first at the buffet. What? Oh, seriously? Oh, yeah, I know it sucks, but that's what it says. So that's what we gotta go by. Thank you. I appreciate it, Morty. I know you were sucking the Kool-Aid out of the Vindicator's dick, so that's why popular people are f***ing dumb. And why your pretentious, poorly written, high-budget friends back there can eat a double-decker shit sandwich. We're gonna be a great team, like Moses and his buddy who like to collect seashells. Boo-boo today! Welcome to the Moses hey. and the Rig Show. That's what's up. I'm Pickle Rick! Woo! <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> Boo Boo Judy! Welcome to the Moses and the Rig Show. Moses Heaps, fuck you, old man. And there's Rick. And she's a bitch. I'm saying, you know what I mean? Me and this girl's great together. She's like, I don't know how uh, that girl ever said you laid a hand on her. I said, thank you. Ooh, that's square. Boo Boo Judy. Welcome to the Moses and the Red Show. (laughs) Look at that. He's here to pay his respects. Welcome to the Moses and the Rick show, everyone. The real intimidator. Rip to, to the racist tar tonight. How's everybody doing tonight? Good to see y'all. Good to see y'all. Uh, you're Good welcome, Dark Chuckles. Ho, Laura. There's a new one. Ho, Laura. Huh. That's a new one for me. R.I.P. Ho, Laura. R.I.P. Ho, Laura. <laughs> How's everybody? <laughs> I don't know who Ho, Laura is. Uh, all right. This She's an out. OG. She's an OG from the Ho community. You didn't know I hear about her? Oh, there's a Ho community. <laughs> oh, there's a Ho. There's a Ho other community out there. No Jeff- way. Yeah, there's Jeff Bice. He just got out of jail. He was in there with Durkee. There's Polly's Hayride. What is he? Yeah, she was just in jail. She was in there with Iceman. There's Mason, Mustard Squirrel. Little Steph with the numbers in the house. Tony Smith Jr., Cubic Zirconia, Bundy, Wild West 82. Yep, shit stir. I did that right just for you. Actually, I didn't realize that was the one that I took off. But yeah, I took that one off. There's Pang One. I like that name. Pang Pang One. The Church of Baconology is here. Yeah, Church of Baconology is always in the dab comments. Uh, Let's see. Who else? Rare Fine Simple too. There's all kinds of people up in here. Cobra would go to the Church of Baconology if he didn't worship the devil. <laughs> but his his, his his allegiances are to Satan. Satan. Satan himself. I saw that mustard squirrel. I saw that. I also saw Paul Davis up there uh talking about <laughs> I saw well I was over somewhere. I was listening in on something. I heard uh Paul Davis said that he invited <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, thank you, Blessed Mama of Two. Miss Paula sent me. Well, we hope you have a great time. You will. Oh, you yeah. will. If you like to You'll laugh. have a good time. Just don't go back to Paula's. That'll be cheese. <laughs> There's no need to go there. <laughs> uh, there's Ho Laura. Now I see it. It's a, my, it's a milky thing. Anyway, so I was listening, and Paul Davis said that, <laughs> wait a minute, wait till you hear this, Moses, um, that he invited me to meet him at a trucker thing 
trucker convention but i told him oh no i can't do that because my i'm afraid my family will find out what i do on the internet (laughs) (laughs) first of all first of all he never invited me to anything like that i wouldn't have gone because i'd be afraid that he would uh throw me in the back of a semi truck and chain me to it but uh we never talked about that we did however talk about he told me that uh keep feeding into square i was crying out for help little buddy in the worky verse said i was lying about say i was lying about everything i wasn't i'm letting demons win going to get me an eight ball of meth and me a rig and get fuck up thank you moses I think you and Moses being alone as a trucker and no one to talk to only messages is another win for the demons. Prayers and love going out, Mr. Davis. I don't think I have. You were ever invited me to a trucker convention. I no. certainly wouldn't go to one. He got mad because that chick up on squares uh, calls one of her trolls a dirty, stinky trucker or something like that. I don't know. So yeah. he, got, he got offended, <laughs> but. Oh, that little bastard. You know, he actually went to the hospital one time, and you was the only person to check in on his stupid ass. Everybody else yeah. was like, oh, I hope he's dead, you know? Yeah, yeah, sure was. And Justice for Tyler, to... though. Justice for Tyler. He was Justice living behind Tyler, Walmart. Yeah. He was living behind Walmart, and uh, he went to go get him some pizza pizza from Little Caesars, and he didn't have a dad or anything, so he's just living in a tent. Well, he had a dad, but his dad was a junkie on the road being a truck driver. Yeah, and he went over to Little Caesars. You know who you know what you got. You know what happened. He got killed. Yes, you know, justice. You know who killed him. You know who killed him. Who? A couple of black boys. <laughs> that's 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 what the newspaper said. <laughs> yeah. I still yep. got that clip of when he threatened to kill JM. That was pretty. Yes, funny. Yes, that was a good one. <laughs> that was a good. I one. mean, not that funny that you know. And not funny that no. JM would be killed, but funny the way he, uh, you know, said he was going to do it. <laughs> yeah, I got tr- he got triggered. He got so triggered oh, yeah. at that time. Oh my god, it was awful. It was awful. It was, yeah, it you was and I heard him. You and I heard the fool say to Square. What? He says, Square. There's a. I got. I got a feeling there's a hundred thousand truckers going down to Texas. And won't you join the convoy, Square? It's right up your alley. You can. You can be a journalist. You can report on it, Square. I'm going to stop by and pick you up. 100,000 strong going straight to Texas border. It's going to be January 6th, but it's going to be on February 3rd. Square's like, you know, I, I think I'm, I'll, I'll, I'll go. I'll, I'll be there. I'll, I'll go. All right, we're oh. looking for the church, Square. I'm going to wrap it in your face, Square. I thought he's going to wrap it in his face. He was going to wrap it. Uh, do you remember when he was going to oh, wrap yeah. it in all the Worky First members? <laughs> so, yeah, he went around and got everybody's permission on, on a live. Yes. Is it okay if I put your avatar on the side of my truck? Because I'm going to wrap it in the biggest Worky Verse truck rolling down the road. Keep America moving one mile of box of Fruity Pebbles at a time. <laughs> a box of Fruity Pebbles. And then he's no going to buy that, that billboard. He was going to buy a Squares Exit. <laughs> yeah, this one right here. <laughs> These ones right here. <laughs> Remember that Square was gonna be all asleep right there on it. <laughs> so I'll show where I live, Square. <laughs> he was also he was also uh, at one point he said, uh, you know, I know the exit for Hay Town. I'm gonna come and drag you out of your house, Square. <laughs> mm-hmm. He was, yeah. Yeah, just yeah. another one that threatened to kill Square and is now his butt buddy. <laughs> just you know, another. I caught uh, I caught Little Me's live uh, yeah. earlier today. Of mm-hmm. course, the Hillbilly and Square spokesman, they're not going to hit no damn panels. They're just, no. I don't know. They they didn't hit ours. They're scared to death. But yeah. uh, he was trying to get him to hit his penalty. He, he played a little clip, though, of a spokesman calling his Uncle Emery, who apparently Ooh. is with the Pagans, and and he tried to get him to kill Square. He put a fucking hit out on Square. <laughs> he put like a little retarded hit out on him. It was crazy. <laughs> Can you imagine that phone call? Can you imagine it? <laughs> Uncle Edward, there's this guy named Squarehead on the internet. And he he's talking sexual shit with my sister. <laughs> it's going to take time to maybe kill him. 
Sasquatch went. <laughs> Sasquatch went last week. <laughs> but damn, oh, Square, you got a little spokesman wanting to kill you, son. My lord. I know it. I know it. It's crazy. Crazy. He's got a plethora, a plethora of plethoras. And I did not catch no disease from a goat. <laughs> I got it from not washing my hands. <laughs> what does he do when he comes over to the other chats? What is it? <laughs> He's on his what? Uh, I'm on my spy shit. <laughs> <laughs> Not to be confused with the Not to be sexual confused with shit. sexual shit. <laughs> Sisquatch is in the sexual shit. I do spy shit while I'm there. <laughs> you said Little the dumbass. other night. You said the other night that you uh, don't even realize it, but sometimes you'll talk to your animals and the spoke yeah. start voice comes out and you start, here, kitty, kitty. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy shit in these YouTube streets. But the craziest shit of all is that we are laying to rest one of our own. Well, not one of yeah. our own, but no, no. one that wanted to well, be. Well, I own him. I own him, but. Yeah. Yeah, I'm you owned him. Releasing for sure. him. Sometimes you gotta just let the cow wander over the rainbow bridge and into the abyss because yeah. his brain's been there for yeah. quite a while. Right. Yep. Yep. You know, he. Uh, he. I. I think that you. You. You squeezed all of the all of the sense and, and content you could get out of him, and I think that he's just he's. Pretty much dead. He's dead in bed, is what Mo said. But you know, I mean, uh, well, yeah, we know we're just going to let him rest and piss, rest and yeah. piss. So, what are we going to get started? Oh, let's see here. What feller said? I'm going to read it. <laughs> I'm going to tell Uncle Emery on all you guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm on my spy shit. Fuck them all. Fuck them all. <laughs> Oh me! Yeah, I got Maro for fucking goats. <laughs> it's it's somewhat true, somewhat true. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, I just uh, they're they're. I tell you, I never realized how much um content. I really thought that like, okay, fine, finally we're rid of them. When uh, they got kicked out of the working or stuff, but finally we don't have to. But they've given us more content than anybody here lately. Like they're doing more for us. Um, yeah. In uh, yeah. Square or Rebel, anybody. PJ is a pickpocket thief. You're Not right. Not a pickpocket. Don't pick pockets. I poke around in pockets sometimes. <laughs> That's it. It's not sexual shit. I just poke around in Uncle Gwen's pockets. <laughs> okay. We do have uh, we got some videos oh, oh. to watch tonight. Do we I do think Durkin's still locked up? Yeah, probably. Durkin's probably still locked up. Bo can't figure out how yeah. to use a bondsman, and who knows, you know. Yeah. Uh, she, yeah. Plus, she's letting him set. You know, everybody's told her. I'm sure that's the best thing for him. She let him set for about eight or nine days last time. Yeah. He had a much higher bond yeah. last time, but uh, but he still sat there for a while. Yeah, and I, you know, this might be the only piece she gets, you know. Yeah, and, and maybe she's. Yeah. Gonna, I'm sure he's calling her constantly, but maybe she let that well, yeah. secure account run out. You know, hopefully. Well, he he I misses wonder, his baby. He misses his baby. That's for sure. <laughs> I wonder if they let him wear Chig's ring in there. That's what I want to know. <laughs> That's right, Chesco fan for life. Bo wants her husband to be free. Oh, she's pregnant with her grandbaby. That's still my favorite line <laughs> of all time. <laughs> pregnant with her grandbaby. Yeah, uh, Darky getting locked up. Well, we got. Well, we're going to talk about that a little bit. Uh, wait a minute, yeah. spokesman. Is that his YouTube channel name? His YouTube channel name is something like Little Spokesman. I love Square. Uh, Books's balls are in my throat. Hashtag fuck trolls or something like that. I don't know. It's one yeah. of those things, you know. It's one of those things where it's too much. Yeah, Thanks his, his contents. His contents hard to to. 
fathom too, you know. Yeah. Not a real smart, not a real smart guy. I saw Polly Polly give us uh, five memberships too. We appreciate that. I hope oh, somebody thank you, Polly Polly. Uh, Chief Pounder Hard wants to know. Uh, well, hold on a minute. Let me find it. Uh, let's see. There it is. Can we get a rebel yell? Oh, we're going to get rebel yells. Oh but, yeah, you know, <laughs> definitely. We got a yeah. There, there's going to be probably the three final rebel yells. We got some videos to watch of him first, though. I think. Okay. Well, we got. Uh, I went so back. Were... I went. I went way back. You know, we're going to go back from uh, 2022 on. Just a mixture of all kinds of wow. crazy. Just a mixture of everything. <laughs> everything from back when he was calling me Moses with the roses. And he was kind oh. of making a little bit of sense all the way up to the fight. And, and oh, much it's, more. It's a documentary. And there's a dab. There's a dab coming oh, yeah. to Baconology. You just hang on. Yes. So it's going to be like a documentary of wet brain from beginning to end. So here we go. Let's go. With, let's start it off. Y'all ain't caring about me. Care about what you think about me? Fuck the fuck now. Fuck you. Fuck that shit. I ain't fucking gotta fucking deal with your fucking ass. Fuck you gonna tell me what the fuck to do? Bullshit. Cause I'm a mod and I first be in here and do all that shit at the same time. Yeah, motherfucker, who you talking to? You. Right. Who the fuck is on to? I got extra pepper cheese. Fuck you! I will slay your fucking phone to the fucking damn murder fucking Chris. Look at Chris! Fucking motherfucking bullshit! She's drunk. No, she's fucked up making a scene out of nothing. She's making content for these lame ass punk motherfuckers. You don't be having to bend down. Would you get on your knees? Show them. Yeah, and then crawl. Oh, there you go. Yeah. That looks good, don't it, y'all? Oh, it's. I heard the P word. No, what did you say? No, you didn't. About the pussy? I heard a P word. My P stink? I don't know. My P stink, because I ain't the best. Hey, I'll rock a raccoon hat in front of the black boy. You sing damn black song if you wasn't. Didn't then you wasn't black and you didn't vote for Biden. Smoke on, you and your sister choking on your balls. Is this old man choking on your nuts? Ah, Mokon's sister wants you to reply and look him in the eye. And seen a woman look like that Mokon's sister. Mokon's sister? But I ain't never seen in my life seen a woman look like that Mokon's sister. You the one that voted for Biden, Mokon's sister. And I'm gonna get on the mic and talk shit to Mokon's sister. And Charlie, I'll tell you, man, buddy, you got some balls. Because, man, you know how many motherfuckers, Charlie? That if damn looked at you and been like, hey, you're a low cow, you're fucking self, dude. You got some reason to talk, dude. A lot of them leave you out, just like Chad. So you were sugar over, or Harley? Harley's trying her best, like it's a god dang award or something. Inbred motherfucker, like she's crying over a damn angel mama on some pancakes, sir. Yeah, meanwhile, pull your fucking goddamn pants up. I see how they run with my chickens. Hey, look, there's the dumbass himself. He's <laughs> wrecking the house. No, it's Moses. No, for real. He's not. He's blasphemy, dude. He takes Moses out the Bible and puts it in parts it with the Red Sea to make his fucking show. <laughs> he ain't offending me. He making me laugh every time I turn around. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to argue with you. I'm, I'm done. You gonna sit over there and argue with me like that? I'm not gonna do it. Now you know the other boy that like your ass. So now, law country Southern rebel. Ain't no damn liberal going right boy you like you. Like Ain't no goddamn. You fucking take all my food stamps, cause I'm gonna give them to you. Cause I never gave nothing to you when you were fucking growing up. Are you talking about your daddy? Yeah. How he gave you some food stamps when he never gave you nothing growing up? Like ain't nobody ever had a low life piece of shit, Daddy. I was sitting on my porch. You ain't never had a porch. In my in my <laughs> trans. No, no, bitch. Tell me that. But I'm telling you that because I. I'm telling you that. I'm telling you that. I'm telling you that because I ain't got a porch now or a house. Hey, 
Just because I ain't got a house or a porch, why the fuck you with me then? And see what you do to me? That's why I say you're bad for me. And then now we make content for some other punk ass, bitch ass motherfucker. Just quit. Tell her. Don't tell me. You over there acting like that little dog down <laughs> little hillbilly. Rebel shit. That's Harley. I don't know who the fuck's who. Y'all ain't never met each other in person. Y'all don't know who the fuck is who. I don't believe none of the fucking one of y'all. I don't believe y'all till I see you in my face. Fuck all y'all. I don't give a shit about y'all. Rest in peace, Richard Petty. Quit. The animal comes upon you. Fucking retarded. You shove a cane up inside your dog. They're fucking threatening my damn service dog. You know, we're, you do realize we're in a troll community, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ruski had said something like that before. Putting that song in the background was kind of poor taste, dude. Oh, Zeeps, what do you... Yeah, I should have known you'd be in here. How do, how do you feel? How do you feel about that? You're gonna end up on the uh, Rick and Moses show just talking to another man? I've been on their show. They've talked about me on their show. Look here. Moses fucking went to some lady's chat acting like me, man. Which it was kind of funny. I thought it was actually kind of funny, you know, where, where I can't see that good. They th I grabbed the Pop-Tart instead of my phone. Get it now? Oh, yeah, but that's the thing. You were being a funny character and making a joke. No, yeah, I never. No, no, that would be Moses. I, I could say Catfish Cooley. I met him. There are people in the chat that do hear us. They would be technically part of this conversation. And that's like eavesdropping is all that is. These people say that you're, you're a heroin addict, you're a pill popper, you're a this and that, and you have a bad history of all this and that. No, I did have a bad history of it. Chicken shit to make their content and shut her face. Oh, yeah, I know that. Man, you'd be surprised at what the damn outlaws can find, man, at their clubhouse. And the Mexican cartel, dude. Talk about connections, Bubba. What South is, That's they'll right. donate the whole fucking team when a hurricane comes through. We showed our black support and control weather. Oh, shit! I don't have to work long. I mean, we like work four hours. Dude, Rebel, yeah, much better. I don't give a fuck. Gene team hiding behind damn books and damn Gene and them big set of titties, boss lady bird. Hiding behind books and Gene. The two whitest motherfuckers that there is on the planet. Square, if you're too dumb to realize that with your Freemasonry and your little Masonic ring, you're putting a little bit of cocaine on Rick Sanchez's damn shit. Meanwhile, but you and Moses Seeps don't want to be my friend. She said, they got me mowing. You believe that? I was going along across the screen. Yeah, I'm handsome. Thanks, Moses. You're an asshole, too. Pretty sure I'm not gay there, Moses. Pretty sure women like me. Yeah, at least I show my face when I go online. Close one eye and look in the mirror and tell me if that was a good idea to show your face online. I swear, did you buy her $200? He was saying he was going to buy Gene and Bird some subs. He a collab with him or working with him on YouTube. Unless I want to put I'm a racist on my forehead too. Sitting on them little twin beds. One day I'm a racist, one day I'm a Klansman. I'm not gonna dox anybody. I'm not gonna dox anybody. Why would he hang with Filthy Animal who hides behind a cartoon character and Moses Heaps if they weren't pedophiles? Moses Heaps is a pedophile? Huh? What? If God bless, I forgot about half that shit. Oh my yeah. god. I forgot that how fat Ruski was. Yes. I forgot <laughs> about how big Ruski had you golly. <laughs> he really has. Yeah. yeah, Tennessee Tactical. That was creepy as hell what he said about take a little cocaine. What? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, yeah. I thought you'd like oh. that one. <laughs> Uh, little feller says, Moses Heaps, there's a few spokesmen in this community. Just know that we are on the same page. I know that you know that I know that you know. <laughs> feller, oh, yeah. You know. Yeah. yeah, there is. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there is. There is. There is. Uh, yeah. Tennessee Tactical said, you're Moses lives rent free in all their heads. It's crazy because uh, that right there was like early on Rebel. And that yeah. was before, you know, we call him a wet brain, but it's almost like instead of his brain being uh, damaged from alcohol use, his brain's actually damaged from getting trolled. 
it's it's <laughs> yeah. it's it's uh he was uh, so happy in some of those uh, older clips too like he was a little bit smiling and you know trying to make yeah. a little sense you know and and it just yeah. gets worse and worse to the point he's like, Ugh, I work four hours like a blue, co- blue collar Southern Outlaw Country <laughs> Rebel. And those also um, show how much of an alcoholic Mo is, an alcoholic mess, should I oh, say, yeah. that Mo is. I, I forgot all about her talking about her pee stinking. Yuck! Who does that? <laughs> oh, they're stuffing her face full of pepperoncinis. You don't know nobody. I'm fucking know nobody. I fucking see it. <laughs> I'm a mod. I deserve to be. <laughs> yeah. Even Mike was laughing right in their face. <laughs> that was the best part. Was Mike's grins. <laughs> Mike's just shaking his head. Mike figured it out. I, it's crazy. Yeah. It, Mike's like, how did I get a front row seat to this fucking wrestling match? God almighty. <laughs> I hope that's in here somewhere. Moses oh, did break is. again. Yeah, Moses is. You know what's going to happen to Mo? What's Mo going to yeah. do when Rebel's gone? Well, I mean. Is she going to stick around? I don't know. Oh, I don't know. She's going to wander through that. chats every now and then, just irrelevant, not knowing what's going on, you know? Yeah. Just go and say, hey, y'all. And then as yeah. soon as somebody uh, mentions uh, alcoholism or, or uh, <laughs> racism, she just kind of yeah. bows out. And, uh, yeah. Don't want to mention it. anything about that gun being pulled on her kid, you know? That's the <laughs> other funny thing is uh, Durkee went to jail for brandishing assault. Yep. Yep. And trespassing. And we saw Rebel do that all in one stream. <laughs> we did. Several times. <laughs> Several yeah. times. Uh, uh, let's see here. PD said, Mo is probably going to start selling cigarettes at the strip club. Maybe you could uh, yeah. get Mom out of the closet, PD, and uh, have her tell Mo the best place to do it. <laughs> selling cigarettes at the strip club. God, yeah, she'd she give her knows. tips. Uh, uh, Leslie was was she did that at you know high dollar whorehouse where she was working at <laughs> before she ended up in <laughs> Petey's closet, dead. <laughs> we <laughs> Moses has just decided that. I mean, he's never really held his tongue, but he's really not going to hold his tongue anymore. So beware, nah, beware. There's no need. Gloves kind of like those all. channels going over us right now, the goddamn square. He knows yep. better. He's done been live for eight hours today. Hell, oh, how much more? Oh. How much more boring can you be? Flip it over well, rusty trucks and flip it over rusty trucks. We'll find out <laughs> just how much boring you can be. <laughs> Told y'all. Told you. Gloves are off. Uh, square and they have to go live because they have to have somewhere to go to pretend that they're not watching the other <laughs> shit going on around them. You know, square just like a rough, uh, square had a rough day at work. He had a rough day at oh, work yeah. today. Square <laughs> did. Uh, let's see. The Church of Baconology said, as soon as I saw Dirk, he went to jail. I started counting the minutes till this show. <laughs> <laughs> well, so let's talk about that before we we put Rebel to rest. Mm. Yeah. And everything. Let's talk about the Durkee stuff a little bit. So, um, right. for anybody who's not completely up to speed, why don't you bring him up to speed, Moses? What, what you know, and all that good stuff. Uh, police report says you know he went to this guy's house to apparently talk to a woman or something. Who knows? Mm-hmm. And uh, he went over there raising hell. And the guy said, "Leave." He left. He come back, and the guy smacked the hood of the truck. You know, said, "I said get out of here," or something like that. You know, and Dirk. He pulled the gun out and said, I'm going to shoot you. You know, I'm going to kill you. know, Dirk, he pulled his little. Yeah. I'll blow you back 30 feet with this motherfucking Glock 9 Ducks Unlimited 357 45 caliber 22, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And went to jail. But now the thing is, he was supposed to go to the regional jail where he always usually goes, right? But Billy's in there. Right. And he's a witness in the Billy case and Billy's hollering police brutality and false arrest and everything. So they said, you know, fuck that. We'll send him to, uh, I think it's called central Southwest central. It's just up the road yeah. in Charleston, where it's a little more rough. Right. 
It might be and, a little, little more black boys in there. Um, and now, like, his bond is $1,000. Yeah. And Bo can't come up with that. Can't, can't she figure out how to... Come up with it. Yeah. She can't figure out how to use a bondsman, apparently, because it would only be $100 if you got a bondsman. Uh, yeah. Surely to God, she could sell... And I guess, you know, whatever she's got there, some suboxone or something to get it, whatever the fuck they sell. Yeah. 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 I mean, something for a thousand dollars. But like we said, I'm sure that she, you know, this is probably the first bit of peace that she's gotten since Chig died. So maybe, uh, you know, can a drilling retard get a bib, please? (laughs) All the bibs are out. All the bibs are out, but uh, yeah, I think that. Was that directed uh, at me? Was that directed at me? I got a notebook. Give me my fucking crayons back. <laughs> I didn't eat that uh, one. Give me that one. If Bo was smart, she'd leave his ass in there and move away. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, she would. But, you know, Bo mm-hmm. isn't too bright. She always, what did, What was it she used to smoke? I can't remember. Uh, I just smuggle all crack. Do a buck wild smuggle all crack. <laughs> I can't imagine. I wonder, I bet you uh, Stu Bob and Mamie are over there. I bet they're smoking a little crack and doing mm-hmm. all kinds of shit. I, you know? I, I'm sure you that know, they're having... Donald was, uh, Donald was talking about this motherfucker just laying around with his mom watching TV in his underwear, laying up in her bed. Like that's that's not normal. That, he was laying in his underwear watching TV with Bo in her bedroom, you know, wearing Chig's fucking wedding ring. I mean, yeah, that's both right. pregnant like, with the grandbaby. Yeah, it's not yeah. right. It's not right at all. No, there's all kinds of things yeah. not right in that in that little yeah. situation they got going on. Their relationship is disgusting. Yes, it is. It's really disgusting, especially when not only is she like being sex trafficked to her own son, but he's <laughs> also like um um spousal abusing her it's crazy it's the craziest yeah. shit i've ever uh i tell you what's really crazy though is that's just the story of why he went to jail yeah. you know there's he really went to jail for some other shit there's a couple of the reasons he went oh really how many reasons is there <laughs> see i'm his handler i'm his manager I work all the finances. I own all the intellectual properties. <laughs> and I happen to know the Ten Commandments, the real reasons Durkee went to jail. I can't wait for this. <laughs> this simple stuff, like number 10. The troopers just wanted to know uh, how he got such a good deal on his weed. So they called him. They hauled his ass into jail. He ain't telling them. <laughs> it's like a standoff. <laughs> Mexican standoff over yeah. his good deals on his weed. He gets the best California weed with the Michigan stamps in West Virginia at the gas station that you've ever seen. <laughs> I'm sure you're right. I'm sure you're the right. The real reason he went to jail with it was number nine. He's trying to sell a go kart frame to a boy in C block. <laughs> He said that some of a bitch is worth five thousand dollars. He wants at least eighteen hundred. <laughs> Remember when he was talking to the fake kid back in July? He's like, "Go, go back across the fence, there, kid. I'm fixing up your go kart. Your daddy just bought it for a thousand dollars from me. I'm putting these stickers on it. It don't need a seat or a steering wheel. <laughs> the stickers. I forgot about putting the stickers on it. Yeah, <laughs> it's all about the stickers. Don't need brakes. Don't need a seat. Chig put a, a motor on the back of his last thing he did before he croaked. <laughs> the real reason he went to jail, though, was number eight. He was only put in Facebook jail, but he wanted to prove a point. <laughs> to all the haters. Yeah, take that, you haters. <laughs> take that, Zuckerberg. Don't go to the real fucking jail, you know what I mean? <laughs> That's what every one of those comments that he makes. He says hatters. He calls me hatters. It's like a (laughs) yeah. It's the concept of hatters. You're not understanding the concept. No, Henry. He never hooked that motor up to anything. That motor was just sitting back there. I mean, it was mounted, but that was it. It wasn't connected to no drive. Nothing. Nothing. Just fired up, sit there and putt. You know what I heard?
bird he really went to jail oh. for? Number seven. What's that? He overdeflamated and caused an explosion. <laughs> Feds rushed in, took him straight to jail. That'll happen when you deflamate so much. <laughs> He's so stupid. Thanks, it's true. You know why he really went to jail, number six? <laughs> Have you ever seen 60 Days In? Undercover boss? Ernest goes to jail? Come on, people. Use your head. <laughs> He's doing fucking research, for God's sake. He's in a Netflix documentary. He's, he's going to go to jail. When he oh, left, that I sheriff just... said, thank you. Thank you for, for being here, sir. I bet I bet you a couple of jailers end up joining the uh, the fake uh, playhouse cast over there. Oh, yeah. The man yeah. Begins to They'll come see him. Him, them and his buddy will come see him. Yeah, have, in yeah, reality, the jailers will probably join the the heaps peeps on Sunday. I'm sure they will. <laughs> <laughs> if they don't, they should. If they don't, they should. <laughs> oh. oh my God, this is great. This sex was this is what happened. Number five. This is why I went to jail. <laughs> Billy had a typo while he was given a jailhouse sign language. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens when you're in a wheelchair. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I hate to I hate to interrupt it here at number five with Billy giving jailhouse sign language. You know, he was trying to uh, say send Durky a message and ended up being like, you know, go arrest Durky. Yeah. And they can do that. A slip of the finger will do that. <laughs> And this may not even be news. Hell, this may be old news, but uh, Durkee's not alone now in jail. Looks like Tyler went to jail here today. Oh, wow. Yeah. What did he go to jail for? Tyler went to jail today. Uh, it's in there over a circuit court capius. Now, a circuit court would be felony stuff, right? That would be... Felony. That's yeah, not general that's district. That's uh, yeah, that's big boy courts. So they'd be holding him there for a while on that little capius. Uh -huh. And that might be over letting that guy die. Oh, yeah. That was the last charge I remember him having was uh, failure to yeah. give something. Render aid, failure to render aid, yeah. 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 Ooh. Uh, yeah, so oh. he's either probably missed a court date, missed a probation, mm -hmm. done something like that. They've done filed a, dirty, maybe. Yeah, filed a bench warrant out for his ass. Yeah, it's a, uh, oh, yeah, it's a, probably a bench warrant. Yeah, it's a bench warrant. Yeah, that's what it is. KPS new mugshot though, Tyler with a new mugshot, yeah. a new head coming to the coming to the memes. That's right. This is here. A KPS warrant is issued when someone needs to be detained to ensure that they make a scheduled court appearance. Thank you, Hagatha. Y'all don't have a hag. We have a hag. Y'all don't have a hag. That's all I got to say about that. Y'all don't have a hag, and you probably should try to find a hag. So anyway, but yeah, that's crazy. Well, uh, <laughs> I tell you, I bet all of them are celebrating. All the women folk are probably like ready to just throw a party, a pussy party or something. A puss party. Yeah. <laughs> a puss yeah, party. Kind of word. yeah. Oh, wow. Wow, wow. 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 Breaking news. Yeah, so I guess he has somebody to shoot new uh, sign language to. Him and Tyler will probably be talking it up right now. I thought you Tyler. were gonna say I thought you were gonna say he's got somebody <laughs> to shoot cats with. Is what I thought you were gonna say. No, oh, that's be you know, Tyler's in there throwing double birds at everybody. Here's some sign language for you, fucking yeah. <laughs> Billy's this. <laughs> Billy is this. <laughs> but no, really though, this is the real reason he went to jail number four. Uh -huh. He just wanted to play some strip poker with the collards. <laughs> That's what he said. <laughs> mine his mouth, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> More on that later on a different. Yeah, yeah. that may be yeah. mission in the dab. <laughs> Number three. <laughs> They also filed uh, charges for conspiracy to take elderly to pound town. <laughs> That's a felony. Felony. A felony. <laughs> oh, I bet. <laughs> when, um, 
when uh, Bo's uh, OBGYN asked her about the father of her baby. They, it was mandated report and stuff. So that's why they got the conspiracy charge. Oh, God. Oh. Yeah, this this might be the reason he went to jail, though, for real. Number two, he didn't feel like pretending to go to work, so he just pistol whipped a random female. It's possible. It's how it's how dad dad does. Dad dad says uppercut. Let me tell you what he said here on this. Mm, it was January twenty third on that dab on twenty fourth. Yeah. He said uh, that goddamn Cali. He's like, let me tell you. He said I was found not guilty. So you know what that means? He's like, when I see that bitch, he's like, I'm going to give her an uppercut. He's like, I'm going to break her jaw. He's like, because I can't be charged for the same crime twice. Double jeopardy, motherfuckers. He's like, that's right. You better not come back to West Virginia. I'll beat your face in, bitch. I'm like, that ain't how that works. That's not how that works at all. No, that's what he thinks. So he thinks that he's got a free shots on Cali. I swear he does. Oh, my God. I'm sure he does. <laughs> yeah. Double jeopardy. You can't, you can't say I'm one of I got, can't charge me for hitting Cali. I got found not guilty of that last year. Eat this fist. Pa -pow, pa -pow. And he's just walking around like isn't that he's walking around stomping her and like oh he's loving it. Oh, I can't wait to see it. <laughs> the real reason he went to jail though, number one. Jail is just code for autograph session. Yeah, yeah. Cops are big fans. They are. They really are. They've got him signing statements. They've got him yeah. signing just everything. Yeah. Pill bottles, oh. evidence bags, all kinds of shit. <laughs> that was Moses' top ten commandments. Real reasons Durkey went to jail. I bet. I bet more than one of those is true too. Just saying. Just oh, yeah. saying, especially yeah. the playing strip coat poker with the collards. I think that was yeah. probably, yeah. Probably that's all there is to do when you're in jail. Like, God damn, ask me. Don't ask me. I'll just tell you. That's what happened to me. I went to jail. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'll talk about that later. <laughs> Pee Wee Strong said, I wonder if he took his tattoo equipment with him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Pap says, Tyler was going to save those cats for Ruski. Yeah, I need to catch up on that whole story. I hear Ruski's out uh, abusing animals. Now? And stuff. <laughs> Is he eating cats now? His kind does that. <laughs> I, I saw, I think that was in one of Petey's documentaries on him. I think it was. I think it was. Oh, I, I meant to tell y'all, Petey, that um, I got... Uh, one of those things where I couldn't comment for 24 hours for him, um, hate speech because Petey uh, has a short right now where it's um, uh, Ruski's dad as a yeah. transsexual talking about how they have a penis. And I just said, oh, Ching Chong Ping Pong's dad has a ding dong. And they took it off. They gave me a hate speech one. Yeah. It's yeah, crazy. they're getting rough on that. I have a lot yeah. of people in my dabs that are telling me, they're like, why do you delete those comments? Durkey said that, you know, had to delete that comment, didn't you, boy? Like, I'm not deleting anything. It's YouTube yeah. will do that shit. Yeah. <laughs> no, Moses don't delete your comment. If, if, uh, if you comment something that he don't like, he just blocks you and you can't comment anymore. But if your comment's gone, it's not because not even that. It. Yeah, not even that. Like it's just even if you like you said, ding dong gets it. Uh you definitely can't yeah. say the R word. You can't say any of the yeah. R words. There's no right anything that starts with an R. Right. Uh let's see here. Rick, if you need any cash to help you get through these hard times, I got your back. Thanks, Petey. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> oh. Uh, you know, I don't yeah. think people are. I don't think people are understanding the magnitude of what's going on here. We got a man that's laid up here in, in the in some ice in a coffin. Mo's got mm -hmm. her beer in the coffin. I mean, this this yep. dude's dead. I mean, he is YouTube dead. His daddy's <laughs> gonna come down to the basement and just find him dead on YouTube, just sitting there looking at Nightbot, staring down Nightbot. Ice Man to come in and tell him he's stupid and leave. I mean, you know it's bad when, when Iceman comes in and says, dude, you need to get yeah. your life together. And, then, you know, he goes back to his mommy's house and shoots up, you know, in his gums. 
<laughs> Shoots up in his gums. Well, let's watch some more of the decline of the wet brain. Here we go. Who put up devil worshiping statues? Working very strong. Like working very strong. The methadone for life. Where's all the black folks? How come Gene and Books are the only black folks in the community? Where's the black women at? I mean, is Bird the only black chick? Square uh, dated that one black girl, right? Where's she at? I started hanging out with little fella. Then all of a sudden, people started knowing who he was. Sasquatch, nobody knew who the fuck he was. Ruski, nobody knew who the fuck he was. Hell, you're offended by the N-word, but are you going to go up to five black folks uh, when you're trying to sleep saying shut the fuck up? I wish you'd quit saying the N-word. I'm trying to get some sleep. Meanwhile, they're going to look at you, call you some kind of hippie peckerwood. You are Moses, man. If we ever get your face. How you look just like me while you're hiding behind fucking damn uh, ski masks? Meanwhile, you're white as a motherfucker living up in a suburban neighborhood. Nobody docks Mo's fucking kid. You doxed him, and you is a bitch ass motherfucking nigga that you won't even show up oh, to get your ass. Oh, you gonna drop that shot. word? Mo don't give a damn about her children. You Dude. better be concerned about Moses taking that woman from you. I mean, you want to fuck square? I have fucked square. Look at his oh, okay. life. It's yeah, turned yeah, upside yeah, yeah. down. I'm picking up Moses, and he's going to come over, and he's going to fuck the shit out of Mo. That's why she's at the beach without him right now. Hell, we've seen what he's working with. The little itty-bitty bitty eater. And the first oh, thing yeah. you need to do is remove that flag, because you're a fucking disgrace to the Southern heritage. Racist. Well, why are you so quick to use the N-word all the time? That's what I want to know. I mean, why do they, why do they, why do the white people say it, and then all of a sudden the black That's what we're asking you, fool. Yeah. That's what we're yeah. asking. Answer the damn question. Yeah. Yeah. I never even said it in a derogatory meaning. There's no positive way for you to say it, you fool. Quit talking in circles and answer the damn right. question. And, and damn Gene, and they, and damn hanging with uh, Square and Ice, and, 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 and I'm more black than they are. Because they're they idiots like you. Guys. Shut the fuck up and quit saying that word. Exactly. That's what we've been trying to tell you. Well, okay. Well, I won't say it no more. I'll completely delete my channel. This shouldn't take very long. I'm happy to hear that, Rebel, and in well, your you honor, I'm going to sign you, you up as a member of the I NAACP, know. and I'll mail you your membership card. See, Welcome aboard, race. brother. Let me hear you, Rebel, yeah! Let me hear you, Rebel, yeah! Let me hear you, Rebel, yeah! <laughs> You gotta love these guys. I think everybody got a little black in them and can't get down a little wild damn ghetto. Oh, oh you are a shit show. Rip. You're an idiot. It's what you are. Calm music down. Keep noise down. You smoke. You smoke. Keep music down this early? It's not even uh, nighttime. Turn music down. Nighttime sleep. I know, but it's not even nighttime sleep. We've Me no argue. Before. Me no argue. You keep down. No, no noise. He's saying, yeah, but he's saying, uh, uh, you keep music down at nighttime. You you be quiet, and uh, we kick you out. Nighttime for sleeping. I'm like, now you sound like filthy animals. So he already down, come out the gate, racist as a motherfucker. Oh god, you keep it down. I kick you out. Are you Chris Kid? Yes, ma'am. If there's someone on the phone for you. Hello. I got this, Chris Kid. Yeah. How you doing? Yo, you was you was with Miss Roseman? Oh, what's up, uh, Moses? How you doing? No, no, no. You you smoking in room. You smoking in room. Oh, you need Moses, to you need to come you back. You need to come back, Bob. We charge card. How you doing, Moses? You not you not play game. You not play game, me. Okay, you all done? Oh, okay. I, I don't know him. Oh, you don't. <laughs> no, they. Oh, I'm a YouTuber. You are barely a YouTuber. You know, they're on the internet. I went live. Honey. Apple C. Keep running around, damn slandering fucking good old boys' names. Keep running around talking shit. You're going to end up finding your body ass dead in a motherfucker. They know the fans is involved, James. <laughs> is that a woman or a man? What up? What do you think about that, there, Moses Hicks? Carolina Rebel, where's the proof at, dude? I've never seen Rick or Moses say anything about my mother, although I have seen Durkey make pages about her. Why don't you stay off my wall talking your shit about my friends? How about that, dude?
Hey, I hadn't commented on Dom. Ain't that right, Rick? Said cheers. But I'm not making them right now. I done made them. They're fucking made. Hey, how fucked up is your wet brain? Not remember. Fuck you! Can I have a fucking fork in the night, please? Yes, ma'am. But did you ask? Don't fucking ask me. I'm fucking telling myself what the fuck I need. I would say go back. I said what I need. Playing with a bunch of black dudes, and then we go eat collard greens and damn chitlins. Fried green tomatoes. Now that chick was a diabetic, right? Fried green tomatoes. Me and Mo have got to know each other over the past few months, and. Uh, exchange numbers and sometimes she shoots me these glances and when she knows I'm watching you'll see here usually when rebels not looking she winks at me <laughs> interrupt interrupt uh our our show remember that chick Allison Carez Allison Krauss yep you say you didn't know her who did you say it was Allison Krauss this ice man, he's playing in shit. Yeah, like you damn hot and want to slaves, man. No, that's not Tom Petty, honey. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Mrs. Wet Brain is certain that Roy Orbison is singing Learning to Fly now. That is not Tom Petty. Don't fucking dispute me on this shit. And you break your bike. You break your bike. Nighttime for sleeping, huh? She thinks I had your number in there, Rick. She think me and you damn got something going, girl. That's how Moses be calling her. And then play tennis, and then there's a front desk where your your boyfriend will call to say, hello, I think uh, I think I can't get signal. Uh, can I help you? Uh, yes, could you transfer me to Melissa Roseman's room? Okay, she didn't answer. Uh, she's probably getting her brain wet. Do you want me to try again? Let's do it. Let's try it again. All right, I'll try one more time, okay? Okay, cool. Three for Dale. Hi, you there? Oh, yeah. Um, may I ask your first name? First name's Moses, last name's Heaps. How do you know Miss Roseman? I'm actually good friends with her boyfriend, the Colonel Rebel. Oh, okay, because um, I just tried to tell her that there was a gentleman on the phone, um, and she basically said that she didn't want to talk to you because she thinks you're a scam. <laughs> well... She may have been busier getting her brain wet when I called her. Okay, yeah, because I called her cell phone, and it went through on my side. And so I told her, I was like, there's a gentleman. And she was like, no, there's no way. Um, it's probably just a scam. That's no problem. It's it's nothing. I was just going to wish her happy birthday and make sure the colonel brought his glasses with him. Okay. They never answer the first time. She just didn't get to it or something. They're both hard to talk to sometimes. I'll catch them later. I thank you. All right. Of course. Bye-bye. You seen them? <laughs> Look at that mug there. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that was yeah. funny. Let's yeah, we put uh down. we put Rebel through some hell. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, the, the hag's right. Time. He was all he was worried to death on how I tracked him down at that hotel after he made a short stand out in front of this huge Johnny Appleseed. Uh, mm -hmm. statue and said he was in Virginia like it's not too damn hard to find yeah yeah I mean uh, <laughs> I mean they, they all but gave you the the room number you know <laughs> yeah I mean yeah. they would be like uh yeah we're going to uh this city in this state to watch this performer <laughs> down the you know down on the beach we're gonna be in a timeshare it's not hard it's not hard <laughs> to uh um <laughs> google timeshares or like yeah. I said, Johnny Appleseed Hotel or something like that. It's, it's he crazy. did give me the room number oh, that that second one. Him. He did give me the room number there. <laughs> yeah, but he really is. He's uh, he's out. So there's no need going over to his channel anymore. He's just talking to the night bot, talking to his it's numbers. If it goes from two to three, you know, he's happy. If it goes to three to two, he's sad. <laughs> He does, you know, he's been doing that for a long time. I didn't realize that. Uh, he was doing this almost a year ago. Jump out! Jump out! Just wigging out on him. <laughs> he is a wigging out. Oh, he uh he he certainly is gonna be missed by a lot of people, and uh, I'm sure there's lots of people who who would like to pay their last respects to him. Um, lots of people, but yeah. I, I don't know if we, if 
I don't know if I could name any of them, though. They were going to go to his funeral. Well, there's going to be some people in the chat that might want to come up here later and say a few things. But yeah. I can think of a couple of people that would like to say some last words for him. How many people could you think of? <laughs> the line at Cazarelli is going halfway yeah. around the block. I'm telling you, <laughs> they've got them laid out. Rebel flags <laughs> flying at half mast. <laughs> I even saw a few black boys in the, in the line. Did you hear how racist he is? I mean, my God. He really is. Where's the, where's the black really women is. at? I mean, Square square dated a black woman. Where the hell is she at? I want to see her. <laughs> Damn. Uh, there you go. I mean, it's just like. Uh, it gets worse too. Yeah. Those, uh, those those clips get worse. I've got another one coming up here. I had forgotten how racist he got on that um, panel with you and Triple T and Filthy and Jaw and them. Who is bad? Oh yeah, I forgot yeah, that he yeah. dropped the N word. He's screaming the N word, yeah. Filthy for God's sakes. <laughs> and he said he would delete his channel. He's never going to say it again. He yeah. went live the next day and made a community post with the word in there at least nine times. <laughs> he did. And then a video of everybody else saying it except him. And then he laughed, you know, <laughs> saying, uh, I didn't say it. Did I say I get to keep my channel. <laughs> That's the other thing. That's the other way that you could tell somebody is a locale when they think that they have to um, abide by rules to keep their <laughs> channel. <laughs> like, oh, I get to keep it because I didn't say it. You could have kept it even if you did say it. I'd have maybe respected you a little bit more if you'd have said it and then kept your channel. But no, nope. you were so worried about those rules. You know? uh, Lord. <sighs> oh, these okay. people going to attend his funeral, though. These, these people have been there for a while. Number 10, the family, the Jetsons, George and Elroy. <laughs> they'll be there. <laughs> They were both mods. It's two of his best friends, really. <laughs> he was so happy to see when George and Elroy was in there together. Yes, he did. He loved it. The yeah. Jetsons. He'd always ask where Jane was or uh, Rosie. He was. He loved it though. Loved the Jetsons. Yeah. And we talked yeah. to him as the Jetsons. That's the thing. <laughs> yeah. And then talk shit to me for hiding behind a, a cartoon character, as he said. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. Never asked George to show his face, so did he? Never. Nope. Never. Not one time. Not one time. <laughs> this man will be at the funeral. You saw him on the couch there. Tater. Number nine, Tater. That's right. He'll be there. <laughs> Found out a little more about Tater from Mike. You know, he's a wrestling fanatic. Mm -hmm. I can see him getting into it a little too much, you know, wanting to suplex Rebel or something. <laughs> To her, Ken Rana off the top of Mike's couch yeah. on the Rebel. Yeah, he, uh, the, my, that's one of my favorite images is Tater sitting cross legged on the couch <laughs> with his best. shoes off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Who the hell goes into somebody else's house and puts their, takes their shoes off and puts their feet up on the couch? Yeah. And it plays with their balls right yeah. there on the, yeah. it's just crazy. Sure did. It was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> it's hard to probably play with Rebels uh, balls a little later. A little bit. <laughs> oh. Who else is going to show up at the funeral here? All oh, here is one of his buddies right here. Dagburn Gobble. Right, son, right. God damn, some bitch died. Son, what he died? Fucking racism? God damn. <laughs> some bitch comes over to my fucking panel. And I said, hell no, Rebel. You ain't coming up here to fucking drop that damn in word. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I just, I could just picture you doing that whole thing. You just did. Sometimes he loves Gobble, like he goes over and hits his panel and yeah. calls him his friend. Last, uh, last screen stream, he was talking about, you know, they took that three dollars in taxes out so that Johnny will have a couch to sit on, you know, living off the government. <laughs> Fuck section two thirty. Gobble's got section eight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a love hate relationship for sure. He 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 either thinks he either thinks Johnny is his ticket to YouTube fame, or yeah. or the, trolling Johnny is his ticket to YouTube fame. Either way, <laughs> neither one of them's going to work. No. He's not going to be YouTube famous. 
He's so happy that he met this guy right here, number seven. He'll be at the funeral. Jimmy J.J. Walker. He talks about meeting him so many times. Every single time. Yeah, well, everybody's jealous. I got to hang out with the old black boy. He said, hey, I like that, uh, that, that, that vest you got. Let me sign that vest right on the rebel flag. <laughs> And he signed it. He signed it right along the back there. And I said, uh, you know, dynamite, you know, like a little spokesman says. He looked at me like he's crazy. And then the people come and ask me to leave. <laughs> he was pretty cool. It's really the story. <laughs> it's funny because it's true. Because he did yeah. say he said dynamite like a little spokesman. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And he does hang out there a little too much. You know, each time he waits in line, you know, he gets up there to the table and thinks that, oh, I'm here to hang oh, out. Oh, creepy. Yeah, it's like he thinks it's uh, like a, 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 like he's like got, a purchased a personal one-on-one -on -one with him or something. Yeah, yeah. That, that video of him with Catherine Bach was, uh, was yeah. borderline stalking. <laughs> I mean, it was, I'm surprised. Not only that. Charges. Not only that, before that, he told you on panel, he said... Uh, yeah, last time I met her, she told me, she said, uh, let me see your phone. You know, I want to take, take a picture of you. And, you know, she kind of liked me. And I was like, whoa, now Mo's going to get jealous. <laughs> you know, she took a picture <laughs> of me. She probably took a picture of him just in case he went fucking crazy and she needed to show right. the cops. Right. <laughs> just to put a picture with those crazy letters he probably writes to her, you know? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you know. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Well, you know, I mean, he's going to be at the funeral. He's one of his best friends. He sent him a birthday stink bait, you know, number six. Shane, Shane will be there. <laughs> oh, look here, dude. I think I'm going to miss Rebel's fucking funeral. I mean, hell, they say he's fucking dead. I mean, hell, here I am. <laughs> look here, dude. You think I can get a ride back with you there, Johnny? I mean, I know you're fucking mad at me. It's just, oh, it took me a long fucking time to walk here, and I was fucking getting dark. <laughs> Rebel did send me some stink bait one time. You know, he said he sent it eight months before he actually sent it. But look here, he comes there with the stink bait. I mean, <laughs> Moses had to make him send it, basically. But he did say he sent me some stink bait. I mean, <laughs> anybody think he can give me a run in the chat there? And, you know, just hit me up. I got to get back to fucking Banksville. My boxing doctors do next week. I gotta be there. I don't know how to think. Like, look here, dude. I'm fucking. <laughs> oh, here's maybe my ride right here, right back. Uh, number five. She's going through Kentucky Roadhead. She'll be there. Yes, she will. Hey now, hey now. <laughs> hey now, hey now. <laughs> oh. The I'm only so reason sorry. Roadhead, the only reason Roadhead was around mm -hmm. when Iceman was in jail, she was e begging. She was out there getting him yeah. money sent on his books. She all yeah. these suckers sent him money, and the rebel of well, Mo, you know, Mo made yeah. a point to say, "You didn't send him jack shit. You made me send it to him." And yeah, uh, yeah. yeah that's the only reason she was right out there was to, to get money. Yeah, because she's magically disappeared now that uh, Ice Rat's back. Uh, she's yeah. no longer on the scene, and that might be also because he might have threatened her life. But still, yeah, yeah I think she was. I think she's out here e begging. Get back on my fucking internet, mommy. I'll kick your fucking tongue out. All <laughs> 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 fabricating. <laughs> People who's going to attend the funeral, number four. Paul Harvey. Paul Harvey's got something to say. <laughs> I'm fucking right here with Shane, dude. You think you can fucking anybody give me a fucking ride back to fucking Banksville, dude? Like, uh, uh, Shane is... Uh, Johnny fucking Shane's probably fucking going to fucking fight. I need to fucking ride back, dude. Like, look here. Uh, I read one of fucking... He's dead, apparently. He did send me... He did send Shane some stink bait, stink bait one time. I was like, look here, dude. Now that was odd. Paul Harvey was, sounded. Just, Paul Harvey sounded a lot like fucking Shane. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> One thing that throws me off is Shane spells Paul P A L L. That's 
that's one weird thing. He made that's, a meme one time like of, a, of, a, of, a, of, a, of a cell phone with a Pop-Tart, and he made a meme of it, and it said the Paul Harvey edition, P-A-L-L. <laughs> Maybe that was just to throw you off, though. He is you a know? troll. Maybe the... he, is a, he is a troll. Yeah, absolutely. 100%. Like he told Rebel. I mean, uh, the gear. <laughs> <laughs> your avatar is gone where's your avatar oh man did it go away <laughs> yeah oh he got released from jail so they took his avatar away that's fucked up <laughs> stream is getting fucking smart <laughs> um yeah he uh when he was on there with, we were talking about when uh, Shane and Rebel were on, he said, look here, dude, don't you realize you're in a community of trolls? And uh, Shane was the voice of reason, which doesn't happen too often. But no. he was that dude. No. Yeah. He said, I mean, you do realize that they are part of the conversation. This would be the chat. You know, they see what we're saying here. <laughs> the fact. But yeah, got that, got that eavesdrop is what they're doing. It's like an eavesdrop. <laughs> I forgot he called. He said the chat was eavesdropping. <laughs> oh, <stupid. laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Who else might show up? Oh, this this person had better show up. He owes his whole career to Rebel. Number three, <laughs> Colonel Rebel here. A Rebel. I said Michael Jordan to go. Michael Jordan uh, to go. Well, my Carolina. Uh, Carolina <laughs> Rebel, uh, laid in rest, uh, may he rest in peace. Uh, <laughs> he like his beer cold, which his body will be cold. Uh, hopefully, it don't leak on the carpet on most daddy's carpet. We don't want him to leak on the carpet. Oh, uh, they meant to go back to the stove and buy more burr if a burger is warm. <laughs> I don't understand why Colonel Rebel always brings up Michael Jordan, but he does. He always uh, talks about Michael Jordan. Everybody from that area in North Carolina, it's all they talk about. Like, they gotta let you know. Uh, Michael yeah. Jordan, to go. Home of uh, number three, uh, and Timadetta, a Della and Hart, a fucking Apple Locker. Let me hear you, Rebel, yeah! <laughs> there you go. There you go. I'm sure that's not the last time you'll hear it tonight. But... No, no, we might do the three Rebel salute. <laughs> I think that's what we need to do. Now, this is strange. Why the hell would she show up here at the damn Rebel funeral? How does she even know number two? Sue Bob. Hey, I got anything in mozzarella cheese sticks. <laughs> Dirt castles in jail. Where you fucking Boone County making calls? I'm in fucking boot keys and money in my boot. <laughs> Anybody buy any frozen pizza from the gas station? I'll get you a discount, baby. Hot and cold, sugar and sweet. <laughs> Hot and cold, sugar and sweet. <laughs> I'm going to write a book, famous all the way. <laughs> weird as Sue Bob would show up. It's weird. Very weird. <laughs> I mean, what other idiot can show up? I don't know of any other oh, retards that might show up and uh, see number one. Um... <laughs> fuck him up, fuck him up, and chop him. Rebel not dead. He's not dead. This is all, this is all some type of bullshit. So. It's all fake. He's not dead. <laughs> His YouTube channel may be dead. He is not dead. I, I did ask Uncle weird. Emery. I asked Uncle Emery to kill Square. <laughs> so he might die, but I said, Square, Square, calm down. I hate our housing authority. It's going to take your house, but Uncle Emery is going to take your life. I've got, I've got to go. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> square, calm down. <laughs> yeah, square. All, ru down. all ruined. All ruined my birthday. I turned twenty-five <laughs> one time. Fucking ruined it. <laughs> he said, "Calm down, calm down." 
they're calling the housing authorities. They were at, where were they at though? I can't remember. They were over Hello, at, Sasquatch. Uh, Hello, Sasquatch. Hello, Sasquatch. <laughs> filthy animal. What's all that? They're making calls. <laughs> I do not pickpocket. They taught me how to pickpocket at a young age. I just ride up on my tricycle. I take the money out of pocket. <laughs> oh he's like God, one I'm of those. Kidding. He's like one of those them gypsies. Like he's like a, one of them, <laughs> or like you know you go to Thailand like one of those monkeys that go up and steal your glasses out of your pocket. You know. And... <laughs> Look what I got, Uncle Gwen. I got a set of keys, five dollars, and some shirts. <laughs> He's like uh, the little the little uh, puppet on, on Jigsaw, just riding up on his little tricycle, face all weird and shit. <laughs> right, the big ass fucking glasses, son. The big ass glasses been creep me out, son. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That was I like here, dude. I'm fucking, I'm fucking blind, dude. I don't need anything. I can see them glasses all the way across the fucking river, dude. They're pretty fucking big, here, the little spokesman. I'm just saying, look here, dude. <laughs> okay. That was Moses' <laughs> top ten commandments. People who attended Rebels before. <laughs> the glasses. <laughs> When they, they really do freak Johnny out. He mentions it every time he sees them. Right. Uh, Where's that fucking Mikey No Point wearing them in the fucking dark? He's like wearing glasses in the dark, son. It's like freaking like, weird, dude. <laughs> you do, Johnny. And the funny thing is, you do, Johnny, the very best. And you don't even watch Johnny. But he's no. just like, you. You have picked up everything, especially the I'll drop all this out of shot at the end of some of the stuff that he does. You know, he showed up the first time Johnny showed up was at the Skanka funeral, and all he said was, Right, mm -hmm. like I asked him a bunch yeah. of questions, right, 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 right. That's all he said. It's all I knew, like he said, it's the only words I'd ever heard him say. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> so he just kept saying, I think after that, the next one was when we did the top 10 that all of them ended in I. Do you remember that? Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, I can't remember what the top 10 was, but yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Talking about my thinking lights, and Talking about my thinking lights, that's what it was. My thinking lights was bright, white, light. <laughs> fuck them, fuck y'all, motherfuckers. Go fucking, fucking pray for your souls. Oh my god. Phew. God of F says, I hate Johnny, but I love Moses. Is Johnny same? God of GOF has changed his profile. His avatar. <laughs> <I see that>. <laughs> <laughs> it's to all. I was just like the dead man in the casket. Look here. Uh, got any of the mozzarella cheese, dude? I'll slap that look off your face, buddy. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, yeah, whatever Moses says. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, I can't stand it. All right. Well, uh, we might as well continue our memoriam. Right. Of the, uh, so now we've progressed. We're at the uh, the phone calls, the hotel phone calls. I think so that at that point, we had orchestrated with filthy filthy you all the only all of these locales would would give their left tit or testicle to know the identity of filthy animal and carolina rebel had the opportunity to walk and be face to face with the man and yeah. fucked it up can you imagine maybe that's why they all hate him so much i mean yeah, it was, it was gonna happen i mean yeah, he yeah. fucked up. And he got there too late. Like he didn't show up at all that day. And he said they said it rained. You know, it rained on him somehow, but it didn't rain anywhere else. Right. But uh, he showed yeah. up on Sunday instead of Saturday. But yeah, you know. but Filthy was there. Filthy was gonna yeah uh, conversate with him. You know, slap him or buy him a beer, depending on how it went. But he messed yeah. it all up. So that's where we're at now. And I think, so it was the filthy almost meeting. And then it was you calling the hotel. And then you called him 
while he was at the um, the, the cottage, gift shop. Yeah. Oh, and, yeah, the gift shop, yeah. Yeah, and I think that uh, that was about when the final tectonic plate broke and <laughs> um, uh, the, the shift became real obvious. So that's where we're at now, right? So yeah. let's 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 keep going. Here we go. Find stickers. Yeah, people keep sticking them fucking things in my car. Oh, they do. I it have is. to take them off. Oh, dear, that's what I was wanting to do. No, I have to take them off. Oh, damn. That's like government property, ain't it? But she's out of service, guys. And you took your phone. I just don't know what you played. Couldn't play nothing. You took your phone. I don't know what you played while I was at the store. Couldn't play nothing. You took your phone. I thought you meant like right now. Exactly. Couldn't play nothing. Do you not understand? I couldn't play no music. You went, there's not another device. There's no TV. It doesn't play music. No, you can't even remember that weekend, though. I don't know, but if you'll get to the YouTube, please, and music, we can start the show. Well, then, when there, we got 13, and you're just holding them. Yeah, but you, you Yeah, that's how drunk you are. Have you blocked me, too? No. Is that why you're not seeing me? No, I don't see you in there. Well, I see me in there. There's nothing I can do except have to end this, go back, and unblock you. Block me, too. Have you ever heard of Rick Rick Monroe? That's who Moses is. Yeah, Rick Monroe. You from South Carolina. How'd you find this out? You for sure? Oh yeah, I find <laughs> See, he's got a daughter that likes black cars. And he's he's got oh. a whole family that's married in to his family that is black. But see this stuff they don't they don't tell y'all about. What Rick looks like. That would be his wife, but she's drinking at 11 a.m. Yeah, that's Moses and his wife. Yeah, my Good job. Bird's got Bird's got the stuff. Yeah, uh, Bird Bird got and, the. She shared the post or whatever. He's as bald as that baby. Yeah, I'm not about to show that, but these two sickos have pictures of babies up looking at them for God's sake. We've got him. Pull on Rick Monroe. Bird, you like black men. That to me, that sound like the real racist. Walter Allen is filthy. It's got to be, man. Hanging out with some black folks. So what if Burr like black folk? I know when they fucking damn undercover you motherfucking ass. We're not the ones out here damn fucking running around talking shit, doxing people. Right. I don't think Walter is really filthy. If it wasn't him, would he uh, hack someone's phone? I don't think he he could hack anyone's phone, man. You know, Durkey believes that. Durkey says that old uh, Rick hacked his phone. That no old boy said he got that IP address for Moses. Well, you've worked magic with it so far. So you're saying it would be a good idea just to get the IP address and then give it give it into the, some certain body's hands? The sad part is Rebel don't realize how many crimes he's admitted to committing over the past few days. The filthy animal calls upon you. Put a cake in the back. The smell of this around you. That shit was funny. Me and Mo and her daddy were hanging with an old man that that damn has to take pills. Look at these pills, guys. They physically, in reality, my glasses. I bought them and paid for them. Where's my T-shirt? Yeah, where's my T-shirt at? I see. Did you sell out? How much did you make off of that first first line edition? You got the patent on it. It don't work. It don't got nothing to work. But you don't know shit. You don't know shit. I know what you you don't know nothing about rent. Oh, don't talk to me about fucking. Oh, me and her get uh, each a million dollars. So we each get a million dollars. So I don't want to fucking hear from neither one of y'all trying to give me hell. Fucking don't give me hell. I pay my fucking every fucking bill. Neither one of y'all. I don't got to have y'all. But I pay my shit. I pay my shit for me. Well, dad, dad don't feed me. I went and paid for my own goddamn breakfast this morning. Did you ever think you'd hear a 44 year old man brag about paying for his own food? Travel subs on her phone facts. No. <laughs> 
Well, go ahead and show them motherfuckers, because that ain't even true. Mo, oh, you know you're so drunk, you poor dumb ass wiper. You done forgot that you told everybody that he subs on your phone. I had screenshots this morning. Mo said Rebel subs on her phone. And show them then. Show them! Um, yeah, y'all might have seen them old damn receipts where she bought it. I did see where some people erased, erased my shit, a bunch of shit off my uh, community post. Because I, I woke up this morning and some shit was gone. Really? Because I heard your daddy was going to kick you out of that basement if you didn't quit doxing two innocent men and their families on your YouTube page. My dad didn't make me do shit. I live in my daddy's basement. My daddy got a, about a $400,000 house. One man don't need all that. Yeah, some would say that me and dad live like bachelors. I need to rent a carpet cleaner. It ain't my damn carpet. I give two shits about this carpet, Petey. They're so proud that they're fucking black. I got called in Christopher Robin in school. Fuck all y'all men that don't know how to respect your women is all the fuck I gotta say. Right. Fuck y'all if y'all can't fucking defend your women. But you stay with you, Mo, don't you, Mo? You come running right back for another drink next week, won't you? Fuck them all. Fuck them all! You got a problem with Andrew? Put your hand on your head like your hand on your head like that and be like, hey, why you fucking you got a fucking hammer? Hulk 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 number? Hulk 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 you ready for me to fucking knock your fucking ass in that headboard? I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Go ahead, mother. Get her ass down here and take her ass back to where she's from, and you gonna go with her. It's your fucking phone. Yours is over there. Mine's there, but yours about to be done. Get the out of my house. We'll take it. My daddy's house. You know, take it. My daddy's house. You know. Why are you acting like that over Get there? The fuck square? Out. Jump out. That's what I want you to do. Jump out. Yeah. <laughs> Jump out. I forgot. I see. I'm so glad that you keep these archives like you do because um, I had forgotten that she had assaulted him before on oh, yeah. a live stream. Yeah. Over yeah. on, on Andrea, is what is he, as he calls her. Yeah. Oh my God. She blacked his eye. Yeah. yeah. Yes, she did. Like I said, oh, I remember now. I didn't forget about that. I just forgot that she had done it so blatantly, you know. Yeah. And it's crazy. And then he tries to play it off. Yeah, Hulkamania. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, he's scared to death of this drunk lady who's pee stinks that's smacking yeah. him around in her daddy's bedroom. Crazy. You know what else she leaked right there? She said that uh, she pays Rebel cell phone bill. Yeah. He's like, that's not my phone. That, that's your phone. You got your phone. She's like, yeah, but yours is getting ready to be fucking done. She's like, I'm done with it. And uh, she's down there yelling about bills. She's like, don't tell me about no fucking bills. She's like, I help both of you, and y'all never help me at all. Fucking bills. Yeah. Oh, just, I, I don't know. I don't know which one of them's worse at this point, you know? Uh, there's been times when I've actually been had empathy for her and thought she's just in a bad situation. No, she's not. No, she's not. I don't think anybody. And, and if there's any men in the chat who want to tell me that I'm wrong, I don't think any man would see her and say, that's a catch. I don't care if she's got a job. I don't care if she's going to get a million dollars when her daddy dies. Uh, I don't care if her pee stinks. I don't think that she's a catch at all. At, no, at all. Any, I don't think any, any woman that would let the boyfriend pull a gun on her son and not do shit, not do mm -hmm. shit about it, yep. trash. I mean, you're right up there with Skanka. Yep. Skanka left her kids to go and hang out yep. with Durkin for 10 months. Trash. Yep, yep, yep. I'm glad she's going in the casket with him. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's uh so she is Jen. That's the best way to describe her is messy, you know. It's, it's just uh, I like mayonnaise and mustard on my tater salad. You fucking weird <laughs> bitch. <laughs> oh, uh little me says, well, Ruski would probably jump out on Mo. Well, Ruski would uh probably jump out on Mo's dad at this point. You know, yeah. his dry spell has been about as long as uh 
king cobras or squares. So, um, you know, it, yeah. Uh, she was she was texting uh, sexy talk to Ruski. Yes, she was. Yes, yeah, she was. Uh, me too, but I yeah, shut her know. down quick. I mean, I had to yeah. shut her down quick. She was all over me. Yeah. I, it's, the thing was that she would text, and she was texting the number for the show. So little <laughs> did she know that Moses wasn't the only one reading those. Me and Hag have access to that account <laughs> as well. So all those little sexting uh, messages that Mo sent to Moses – me and Hag saw them too. And yeah. if there's nothing that me and Hag do uh, better, it's to take screenshots. So <laughs> there you go. <laughs> but we'll just keep those in our back pocket for now. Good we damn. don't want any. <laughs> and uh, the, um, I don't know if it's this one or the one before that. I forgot the time that uh, Rebel tried to hook up with me to make you and Mo jealous. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God! My favorite, Crazy. my favorite fight though, even above you know him screaming and shoving the dude around, you know her dad was when he said, uh, "She said you ain't got no fucking porch. You ain't never had a porch." He's like, "Listen here, bitch." That's why you're with me. Now you got me goddamn using the Lord's name in vain. See what you do to me? That's why you're not good for me. Now you gave him content. <laughs> She's like, you ain't never had a car, a house, nothing. <laughs> oh, oh, Lord said, wait for the dirt to settle, then do a DM drop. We're going to wait. Yeah, we're going to wait till he's good and in the ground for a little bit. Then we'll drop those DMs. Look, yeah. right now she's scrambling. She's like, what did I, what I take to him while I was drunk? I can't remember trying to go through yeah. this. She's so nervous right now. Uh, it so was just nervous. like, uh, just like that message, you know, that I told her, uh, I said, uh, I know that uh, Rebel subs to people and buys memberships yeah. on your phone. I never said that. You better post them receipts. And mustard squirrels want to call that. And uh, sure yeah. enough, you know, she she wrote the shit. And then I'll be damned if we don't have the her saying, Rebel sometimes subs to people on my phone. Yeah. And the um, it wasn't like it was, uh, uh, it wasn't a troll account with her name because uh, it was her because it had a wrench. In the chat, yeah. so it was yeah. definitely her, yeah. yeah. So she can't lie. I'm just glad she, they're both. I'm, I'm glad that they're both resting in peace now. You know. Yeah, I wish. Yeah, you know. I remember they had a. I had a song wrote about them when they first met. You know, down in Kanapalaki. Um, uh, would that, that be the? Uh, I think I might have that one loaded. I've got a rebel song loaded, not the new one, but. Uh, well, here, let me play it. Let me play it. I'm not real smart and I got a wet brain. Too much but I can drive a man insane. Most at his will. My ticket's filled. Turn a rebel race is cook all the money. Live with my dad cause I ain't got no money. Get what I want from a mo queen bee, honey. Can't change her mind. My crops are fired. Turn a rebel race is cook all the money. Kiss me, Tata. Mmm, feel good. Oh, me, Tata. I want to love you like a southern rebel shoe. I lie. Sometimes they'll turn this wheel too far to the right, 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 right. I like the thing that Mo does with the thumbs. It kind of hurts, but it sure is fun. My brain is crazy. In love with Daisy. Colonel Rebel Race is good. Hurts, but it 
this show is fun. We bring this crazy, in love with Daisy, Colonel Rebel Race, just cook all the money. I, don't yeah, think I forgot that all about that one. Yeah, I forgot about it too. I thought it was it. I forgot all about but, yeah, that that's song. <laughs> that's one of the best ones ever. Colonel Rizzo, Rebel Race is cook gold. Oh my. <laughs> now I'm starting to worry. Like, how many fucking songs did I write about this dude? And damn. <laughs> what was the other one? Um, I'm looking for it. I can't remember what it was. It was called The uh, Queen of Mike's Double Wide Trailer. Oh, okay. Hold on a minute. I think I've got that one too. Let's see here. Let me look for it real quick. Now, that would be a miracle because I don't know. If, I don't even know if I have that one. I'm sure I got it in the archives, but uh, yeah, hell. it's like Gene. Gene yeah. left a message on one of my playlists the other day. He left a message on my playlist that just said, 12 fucking songs. Are you shitting me? I'm on your neck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't believe he just now figured it out. Oh. Uh, let's see here. Uh, no, I can't. I know I've got it somewhere. I just don't remember what I saved it as. I'll have to look and see. I'll I'll look yeah. during the next because uh, you wouldn't believe the amount. That's what I was telling you. You've got a uh, um, an archive, but I have an archive too, and I've got Mandria Square G. No, that's not it. <laughs> Some of the names <laughs> of these things are. <laughs> I've got uh, Mo says Rebel broke. I've got that. I've got uh, a whole bunch of them. He is broke. Rebel Rebel Rich Daddy Carpet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think we just saw a little little clip of that. He got mad at Petey for pointing out that carpet. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Okay, that's Rebel Song there. Does know. he know he's getting buried tonight, T Dan? Probably not. He uh he's yeah. always a little behind. Like he'll figure out Durkey's in jail next week. Yeah, true. What do you mean Durkey's in jail? Did you go to jail, Durkey? He talks to his chat sometimes like people are there, but they're not. Adam Calhoun showed up in his chat the other night. Yeah. Uh, Adam Calhoun. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait a minute. Here we go. No. No, that's not it either. Um, I like when he starts talking to the Durkey, though. It's the Deckery who comes in our <laughs> chat. Yeah. And he starts talking to them like, oh, look, look, folks, it's uh, Durkey. And uh, yeah, it's not. It's not Durkey. Uh, I don't know what I did with that song. I'll find out during the next thing. Anyway, I'll quit looking at All it for right. now. Um, but yeah, uh, do you want to go ahead and uh, give them a little dab? Or do yeah, you let's want do to... that. Yeah, okay. because I want to dab before people start coming up to the coffin because it's I feel tears well, and I'm just thinking about he won't ever be there ever again when we you know Saturday night will come and he won't be live, or if he will, you know All nobody right. will be there. I know. It's going to be sad. It's going to be sad. All right. Well, set us up for this dab. Mm, let me think here. He's crazy as all hell. Uh, he yep. says a lot of very uh, uh, foreshadowing things. <laughs> this was on like the 24th. <laughs> he went to jail yep. a few days later. And, oh. uh, yeah. He, he makes some, some statements that didn't, that didn't, uh, didn't age very well. Okay. Good. All right. Hey, here we go. Everybody say before he ODs on a jelly roll. Fucking donut. Literally. I just got in the truck and that fucking song was playing. I swear to God, I was screaming it down the road. Somebody save him. Him from himself. A Glock would, I mean, he'd be trying to. Hey, well, how do I work this? I hate playing the Vonda, by the way, guys. He, three chords and so simple, but less is so much more. If you understand the concept of that, less is so much more. You people can't concept just how much he hates to play Nirvana. That's right, outlaw, brother, outlaw. I am the police around here. People come to me to collect their property from these feasts. Motherfucker, where's my people shit? That clip didn't age very well. Goddamn crap, you you bought a run. I've done that pouring to him, motherfuckers. You bought a butter knife to a 
Thank you, Sword Blade. I'm Archelius, and you're fucking pissant. I, I mean, I'm gonna stand here, man. If you get five feet here around, I'm gonna empty your chest with a double tap. <laughs> I will f you in the road. Come on, come on. This motherfucker runs into the dollar store. Runs into the dollar store. I will f you in the road, boy. You can run, but you can't motherfucking hide, and you can't out hide somebody that can play bigger than you in this game. I'll come back here, you mother. You stand there screaming. I've been gone for 30 minutes, dog. I pull back in. You, I'll rewire you, son. I'll catch you in these mountains anywhere. My son can save your ass last time. Please, Dad. No. I'm so okay, Junior. Dad will catch him in my scope. That's right, Junior. Dad, that scope boy will catch him. Conley Bay. How dare you come up that motherfucker? I have AR-10. Waiting on your ass. I'll hand you one of my own guns. Let's see. Let's go play battle BB gun war for 30 odd season. See who wins. I was taught to hunt and shoot deer. Mom, mom got her brand new 740, 70, 100, 30, 30, Remington 30 odd six. Bolt action. People, Remington don't make guns no more. Why are you whispering about in there, Derek? Did I buy another gun, damn it? World class. Tasco. That is the best Tasco scope ever made. She threw my hat up on me. I said, whoa. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? He's about to scope me the first shot. Oh, scope boy just about scoped himself. Before we give them crackhead any more content, the one that said, oh, I'm an LD, man. I'm fucking smart as hell, man. Good job. Well done. <laughs> Then nods the fuck out in the hotel. The, it should be called the no Hotel Nodler. YouTube and Facebook is my world. My country, okay? Hate to break the news to you there, Scope Boy, but I've done took over. I own your country. Calling a fucking house, having people put up the, the top of my mother like it. Are you sick in your mind, man? I don't, I don't, I want my whole name erased from that shit. Take that Boone County mating call and make it yours, buddy, and you can live off of it. Look at the law. I said it in a movie as LLC by Tribeca Films. A try trademark from the mouth, bitch. It means I don't have to have a copyright on it. I'm the original f***ing on. How many of you in this world said, Oh, this is the Thompson Johnson County mating call? Not f***ing one. That's so goddamn confusing, isn't it? Another news flash to blow your little squirrel brain. You did not come up with the Boone County mating call. He said we had to throw away 500 hours. Dude, that was probably just all my footage. You're probably right because they said any time there was a camera, you were trying to throw yourself in front of it. I woke up one morning. He said, how you do when you wake up in the mornings? I said, if you don't get that goddamn camera in my mouth. He had the camera in your mouth? Is that what happened to your teeth? It's going to be through your eyeball. I said, get your fucking Nickelodeon chic ass out of my bedroom. Oh, you, Dirty, you are just drawing to the camera. I want to build a barracks. There's no bitches allowed. You're a woodworker. You know what a woodworker is? That's my ex and my other ex. Not convicted, bitch. Not convicted, bitch. Oh, that's just yet to be determined. Hear that? Listen to that G9. Not convicted. God damn, can wear my... I can own 300. What did my son say to me? I'm his baby. Try me, bitch. Let me tell you something about Marilyn Monroe. She's fucking president. Okay? And you can't earn $5 on OnlyFans. I... <laughs> my son. My son said I'm his baby. I'm his baby. Try me, bitch. Junior didn't say that shit. <laughs> Never, Callie told us that never. Callie told us that Junior was soft spoken, the nicest kid. You couldn't believe that they were even related, but that's because he's barely around Durkey, you know. Yeah, yeah, there was nothing. Uh, when he, uh, uh, he's just so cringy. And talking about Jelly Roll, I mean, he started off that stream talking about Jelly Roll. Uh, yeah. Somebody saved me from a. Uh, what did he say? From a honey bun? From overdosing, or, from overdosing on a jelly roll or a honey bun or something like that. Some stupid shit. He's so cringy. Just everything yeah. he does is cringy. 
and just everything. I love the fact that he's standing up, smacking his gun, being like, what's that? Oh, yeah, that's right. I can carry illegally. I got 27 other guns. Listen to that G9 <laughs> Glock, click, click, clock, clock. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Did not age well whatsoever. Not at nope. all. Uh, let's let's finish it off. Let's go ahead and see what else he has to say. Oh, he's got go. plenty. I fucking drink a gallon of her piss to smell where it came from. There you go. Hate on that bitch, son. I know I can wash this bitch's panties on my ass. She is the bamf. She is the darky of them, you understand? I mean, milf, bamf, cougar. Let me hit that fucking pooter scooter. Uh, on a 1962 70 blazer because her legs and the armpits never seen a razor and I'd still pop to that bitch's ass. I got pictures with her with Tupac. Easy E. I mean, she could be with anybody. The only thing that Durkee knows about her is that she has sex with a lot of famous people. Do you know, remember the movie Sandlot? Do I need to say that for you? Remember that baseball? 1952, yeah, I mean, she fucked everybody on that baseball, bro. You keep talking about the 1927 Yankees with Lou Gehrig. Marilyn Monroe would have been one year old then, you sicko. Who the fuck cares about the president? She got him killed by his wife. How the fuck does she know when to drop her head? Kennedy does that, then his head goes down because he shot point blank by his wife. This dude has one special brain. Verse. Thank y'all for making that for me, by the way. Because you know I benefit from that. <laughs> you are fucking idiots. I could be getting stars and making you subscribe before you laugh again, bitch. You'll pay 15 bucks. We'll suck on the f***ing turkey jerky. The Calisandra Pasolata ring. Just jack off the tongue when I thought she works. She ain't worth her nut run down her face. I've done jack it twice since we've been on here. Tracy, this woman looks like a fucking telescriper. And a fucking cousin of mine does so much heroin, he can't decide whether they fucking chew on the right foot or the left. With a CCW, I can come fuck you in your home state. It's like Callie beat that baby. My nephew punched you in the face, and he'll fucking own up to that. But if you walked in my house and I just dropped you, ho. Don't let me ever cross paths with you, bitch, because I will hit you like a man and show you what a man can do. I will lift your fucking, I'll give you a whole facial picture you really need. You've never supposed to be in my house, you prostitute, bitch. The only people that he's willing to beat up are females. Dad, dad will teach you. I can't believe you would charge people even watch you do. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? That's not what we're about, man. This nitwit forgets what he says two minutes ago. You don't have the mentality of us, man. West Virginia University to Minnesota Golden Fucking Gophers. Who in their right mind would do that? One of the number one party schools in the nation. My friend went out with me and shot, and he told me, he said, Derby, I would sponsor you if you would get into long range shooting. I didn't know they had long range shooting in the Special Olympics. I bet you couldn't shoot a fucking 22, could you? I bet after your court case, you won't even be able to touch a 22. Like that little city boy did, didn't he? He said, I thought that 9mm was supposed to go like a 22. I said, you fucking bitch, man. I put my foot on his throat. I said, you need to get the back fuck north. Cool story. Never happened. Where you at, Quinn? You're on the YouTube, right? Talking shit, right? All right, now I'm confused because Quinn is an Eskimo. I don't need no gun for nobody. That's all I need. My cousin, anytime he's ready, dude, bring it on. Let's get this shit done and over with. My son laughed his ass off. He said, why are you trying to cock your gun with your hand capped over your receiver? <laughs> Is that funny, guys? A two-year-old about got shot by a gun? It's funny, huh? I would smack your fucking head off, man. Throw your hands, man. What? Anybody, any one of y'all want to come and try that? Say when? You have to schedule it so that he can call the police ahead of time. Puckle Bear, not Barry. You never come to my house after I just told you you were being disrespectful. You're being loud because you're on them Xanax and broke. Chill the fuck out. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You're right, but you need to shut the... What the fuck you just... He's already beat up like four shadow people this stream alone. They're lucky they didn't get shot. The only reason I ever had a YouTube is my ex-girlfriend made the motherfucker. 
You met her through YouTube, you moron. You had that account years before you met Skanka. It's like I wouldn't believe in selling that jacket as mine. That's all that happened, right? Because I wouldn't help you make more money on my own property. The jacket. He won't stop talking about it. Because I know if I watch one, I want to kill him. Actually drive there and kill him. God be with you. Bless the morning if it comes. Don't hate on each other. Love each other. Oh, what, what'd I say? What, what'd I just say? What I say? What I say? <laughs> that was a My nice favorite. picture of him posing with Marilyn there at the end too. <laughs> My favorite new <laughs> part of the dabs is when you say "cool story never happened." <laughs> 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 yeah. I know, uh, little me. This lawyer, his uh, pretend lawyer, that is a cast member of the. Meth Manor Playhouse. I don't know. I told him at least 10 times. I said, you need to save your time with that lawyer. You're wasting it on me. You're going to need it in the near future, you know. <laughs> yep. Yep. I thought it was going to be uh, over the young girls, but, you know, it turns out he's pulling his gun on everybody. Actually, yeah. <laughs> pulling Chig's gun on everybody. Bo made sure to right. say that. Right. It's, yep. it's not his guns. It's Chig's And we guns. knew that. We knew uh, that. You can't. There's, just, there's, there's nobody in the right mind going to give him a gun, even at Walmart. Right. <laughs> he probably lit up a joint. And was like, I can. I, I, I can smoke this here. You know, hell, he oh, went into a courthouse. He went into a courthouse with weed. Uh, nothing's yeah. going to stop him. I mean, he, nothing surprised me. Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. He really honestly thinks that like he's an outlaw. He's not an outlaw. He's one of those dumb criminals. Uh, yeah. His lawyer only he's an outlaw since you been too long. Yeah. An outlaw year, by the way. Out, yeah, yeah. I mean, he really, honestly, like, it, it, and he's one of those guys that you see on those dumb criminal videos. You know, take it, it just. Oh, yeah. he's so stupid. And talking about Marilyn Monroe, and then for him to say <laughs> that the only reason he has a YouTube channel is because his girlfriend made him do it. Not Bullshit. only did he meet her through YouTube, but um, there's videos of him before he ever even knew who she was. He had his, his you know, all his subscribers. Him. All his subscribers was before her. He didn't gain that much. Yeah. You know, it was they was already there from the movie. You know, that's all he ever had. And that's the whole reason that she got with him was because she was like, I can get you some podcast equipment, you know? Yeah. Yep. Yep. It was crazy. Uh, yeah. He is such an idiot such an idiot and, and just a creep just a creep you know he wants to sit there when Callie was there he just thought he was the coolest thing in the world because he had an only fans girl yeah and now he's gonna sit here and degrade her for being an only fans girl he was it's never just... supposed to be at my house why like the first day there he's talking about she's not going nowhere she's sleeping with me all night right here in this bed right here is yeah. where she's sleeping people like yeah uh, he was so proud uh, of it. And like, yeah. you know, we were like, you know that she does uh seen those pictures and he's like, That's that's all fake. Now it's like, yeah. have you seen the pictures? You know. Yeah, it's right. And that stuff he was talking about, Marilyn uh, Monroe. He was he's so far off on his date sometimes. Like he's not just off yeah. like a year or two. He's off like thirty or forty years. Like he was saying Lou Gehrig. Yeah. He was saying Lou Gehrig was on the fifty seven Yankees. He's on the 27 Yankees, you know, and <laughs> Marilyn Monroe was only born in 26. She yeah. wasn't ever with Lou Gehrig. He was dead by the time she was like 16. Yeah. Oh, it's, uh, he didn't want to be in the wild and wonderful whites, but he never shuts the fuck up about it. That's true. That's true. <laughs> and, and I love how the jacket made another appearance yeah. in another video. At least now he's admitting it was his. Yeah. Uh, listen, next time he, he mentions won't. it, he'll say it wasn't even his jacket, though. Yeah. It was and let me tell you, the Zabruder film, uh, mm -hmm. all all these different angles, you know, the JFK movie. I've never heard anybody say that Jacqueline Kenny, Kennedy was the one that shot him until today. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> his wife shot it's him as they rolled down the road because she knew, you know, to go this way. And then she shot him at the same time. Just, uh, just, I, I, 
and just so sure of himself so sure of himself and his bullshit yeah. it's crazy yeah. uh yeah. yeah that jacket is the gift that keeps on giving for sure uh because he hasn't shut the fuck up about it since since uh filthy blue it as well since we put it up for raffle he hasn't oh, shut yeah. up about, and that makes him so mad I, I love it i love that we can still get him riled up about yeah. it the um, money yeah that's what makes him mad that Donald made money off of it. He's yep. so mad that Donald's making money off of his channel. Uh, yeah. You know, he sat there and he said, I'm going to start getting stars on Facebook and make you motherfuckers pay $15 to even see it. Two minutes later, he's like, you don't charge people to see you on Facebook. You know, <laughs> I sign my autographs for free, $15. You yeah. can buy a shirt. It's 1565 with the autograph. Yeah, it's crazy. Um, I found that song. By the way, play it. It's that's only a minute. Let's play a picture. Uh, this is when they on, first met. It's, it's gonna, it's gonna finish uploading. It'll be like. Well, let's look at the the thumbnail there. because it okay. kind of reminds us too. Yeah. May he rest in peace. Listen, Paula pulled this thumbnail up earlier on her stream, and uh, uh, it is fantastic. But it was really, I don't think I still have. Okay, you go through it. Go through it for us. That's so you got a hag over here with the with the man of the hour. Uh-huh. Rebel. Rest in peace, Rebel. And then you got Durkey who, you know, he's in jail. He'll go through Durkey will go through this phase, you know, where he's done with everybody. He'll probably stop smoking weed again because he'll be on probation. Mm -hmm. You know, he'll, he'll be, be clean Durkey yeah. again. Yeah. Then you got Gene. He's he's been dead for years. I mean, he's, yeah. he lost so long ago. He don't remember what it's like to get a W. He's been smothered out by birds, big ass cheeks. Like he he just don't even know what fresh air smells like. Brownie's looking on because Brownie's racist. Brownie's like, what the hell is this guy doing? You know what? What is he? A racist My service animal. Only guy I've ever seen is ultra white. Like. <laughs> Paper like like see through paper. Yeah, transparent. <laughs> and you got back there at the gates. The gates is the you got the rebel. You know, outlaw rebel. That's Just right. Just a good old southern outlaw country rebel trying to stand his ground against a seventy year old man <laughs> living in daddy's basement. That's right. On the weekends, he goes to Mo's daddy's. He's still upstairs at <laughs> Mo's daddy's house, living like a living like a king. <laughs> Squares up here floating away in the sunset there in the yeah. moon and the moonlight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're dead, Rebel. <laughs> Look at all the And you got a little spokes tar there, a little spokes tar. He's there. Fuck a mom, fuck everybody in this whole fucking graveyard. I'm not dead. My brain is dead on the left side. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't matter. I still lick I up. I still people's pockets. I still their money, and I still the innocence of goats. <laughs> and his uncle Emery's going to steal the life from Square. <laughs> He's going to snatch the life right out of Square's little fag body. <laughs> oh. We got an unmarked grave here. You're you're here at the unmarked grave. Uh, yeah. No marker here. We got a piece of chicken and a black cock. <laughs> I don't know what it could be. <laughs> Talk about me, my guy. Don't forget the sides. Skip on the sides, my guy. I need some gravy. <laughs> <laughs> and there in the foreground you got the the bush light and the rose uh, the rose has come yeah. from moses we all know that uh, yeah and you're standing there in front of as we said you know as a contrast from uh gene yeah. black with a big gold tooth you got a square over here bright white with no teeth <laughs> he's such a creep i swear to god yeah. look at him oh yeah and then, a Who's that there on the far left? I saw. I saw. Yeah. yeah. And then behind him, we've got the man who's running. Uh, Rebels voting for him this year. It's Mayor McCheese. 
That damn Mary McCheese are running with running on the Trump McCheese 2024. <laughs> He's just a good old Southern outlaw country cheeseburger Republican. <laughs> I was down at the McDonald's one time. I was at the McDonald's one time. Well, Moses wrote a song about it. <laughs> Which uh, let's see here. Is it the one that you wanted me to play or the new one? It's the it's the old one. It's the real okay, old right, one. Some of the bitch was like nine months old. Okay, yeah, and it was actually the reason I could find it is because it was on one of our shout out videos. So here it is. They first met in Kannapolis, she was mowing his daddy's yard. He said, I like the way you make your turns, and she could tell he was a retard. And so she took him down to McDonald's where he talked to the mayor of McCheese. He said, let's go back to my buddy Mike's, and we can sing some karaoke. And Rebel made Mo the queen of Mike's single wide trailer with the karaoke machines and the Donald Trump flags. But sometimes she gets drunk and he's got to trail her race. It's black heart and her pretty red neck. She's his queen. Rebel made Mo the queen of my single wide trailer with the karaoke machines and the Donald Trump flags. Sometimes she gets drunk and he's got to trail her race His black heart and her pretty red neck Now is the queen of my single wide trailer With the karaoke machines and the Donald Trump flags Sometimes she gets drunk and he's got to trail her race His black heart and her pretty red neck She's a queen Mo Queen B. Oh yeah. You know what's interesting? All Watch those that losers video. that don't do all those losers yeah. that don't sub to us anymore. Yeah. I saw like three or four losers in there. Yeah, I did too. Maybe more. Maybe more than yeah, that. Yeah, that's all right, because we, we made up more. There she is. There's the drunk ass herself, Mo. Let me tell you. There she is. What I in the hell? You, I hate that you lost him like that. You know, he's gone into the great beyond. And uh, we all feel for you. Feel more for your for more for your kids for having to put up with yeah. both of you, but And your dad. Your yeah, dad. Your I don't dad. Care. That's yeah. that's a damn shame, you know. Yeah. Uh, can't protect him. Can't even get him out of the damn house, you know. You know, Durkey got yeah. charged with brandishing, assault, and trespassing. And he done way less than what uh, Rebel did that night. Yep. Yep. And uh, yeah. not a single charge was filed. Uh, that's right. Oh, uh, Miss Smelly Piss herself. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. <laughs> My pee stinks. My pee stinks. Gross. <laughs> Just gross. <laughs> How can you not be embarrassed of yourself? No. Oh, that's right, Bleezy, poor thing. Uh, she can't believe I wasn't in the top ten to be at the funeral. That's uh, there's still a top, buried with him. Yeah, there's still a top ten left, but uh, I don't know if you noticed, but uh, you were in a couple of the videos. And you were moving like a motherfucker. I mean, <laughs> straight up screaming and acting crazy as hell. Good God Assault. almighty. <laughs> Assault, yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, wait a minute. Is she honestly... No, uh, never mind. That wasn't her. Uh, yeah, it's... Uh, I can't uh, believe that she didn't realize that you're, you're getting buried with me. We're about yeah. as sick as you, <laughs> sick of you as we are of him. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah look, everybody's, 
agree. And you're dead too, ma'am. <laughs> yeah. If you want to tell him just to go ahead and delete the channel, you can. Either way, it don't matter. Yeah. Yeah. Because, uh, I mean, he's yeah, already he's talking been... to the fucking night bot, and, uh, the rest is like, you know, there's a, every now and then there's a troll. <laughs> but, you know, when he, when he bought those, uh, subs from that, that Philippine, I forget her name now. She comes into yeah. this. She bought, he bought some uh, of those Philippine subs. So every now and then, there'll be people coming in speaking a different language and just flooding this chat with crazy stuff. <laughs> That's what you get when you buy them, <laughs> buy them subs. He'll be like, uh, "Oh, hey, how you, Ting Tong, Wing Wong? Good to see you. Good to see you, Ting Tong. Yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> and they will. There'll be all those different symbols and shit. You can't figure out nothing. Oh God." Um, yeah. uh, let's see here. We got one more set of video, but you talked about there being another top 10. Should we uh, maybe go over it that is. before we show the last? Well, it is, it is midnight. Oh, it's the witching hour. So yeah, yes. we need to go ahead and, and get to it here. Uh, rebel rebels dead. I don't know how else to say it. <laughs> Just like his mother, his father, well, not his father is his mother, and his grandfather. Mm -hmm. They're dead, and now Rebel's dead with them. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I wonder and, if he. Uh, I wonder if there was anything he was wanting to do though before he he left. There was a few things, and Mo can might maybe help him do that. You know, right before he dies. But there is a few things that he had on the Rebel bucket list. How many things was there? Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's interesting. Uh, she said, yeah, I'm not dead yet. Or has Rebel come back from the grave on Mo's phone? I don't know. I don't care. No, no, no. Right. Yeah, I don't, Mo's... I don't, I don't think it's, I don't think it's Rebel because he likes to put a bunch of emojis and he can't type and he's, he's pretty stupid. Now, Mo, she can spell. Mo's proud to be a, that's what the, that's where the B comes from. She's the Mo Honey Queen spelling B. Yes. Champion. Yep. <laughs> she told me this one night, drunk as hell. She probably don't remember. <laughs> Rebels bucket list number 10. He wants to make it to a thousand subs before Mo. Well, he's going to do it. I think he'll do it. Actually, I don't think either one will do it together, but never. Yeah, I don't think they could add them up together. Yeah, just like, no, nope, nope. Just number nine. Nope. Mixtape coming up with Adam, Church, Johnny Rebel, and some old black boy from Rowan <laughs> County. <laughs> Mo, y'all play that y'all play that shitty music just out the way too loud and you overplay that uh Austin or whatever the hell his name is. Austin McSuck mm -hmm. is what he should be called because he yeah. McSucks. And the only reason you play is because he's like, I'm here in Rowan County and I'm a good old boy. And of course, because he's an old black boy. And, you know, Rebel thinks he's getting credit for playing that. <laughs> I can't every time you say it. I see why Filthy likes hearing you say it so much. <laughs> yeah. And it's pretty uh, bad the way y'all stood around there and like made that guy wait. Like he's up there taking down the stage and I'm going to go get my vest and let you sign it because he's an old black boy. Like he's seriously saying that. Like there's only three people standing around. One yeah. of the things, one of the people yeah. standing around is the guy's mom. Yeah. Yeah. It was, it was her mom. His mom, I mean. Yep. And your Mo's like, I wish you'd have played that one song. And they're like, uh, we yeah. did. <laughs> we did. Oh, it's probably fucking late out there getting drunk in the car. <laughs> wait till <laughs> wait till intermission and you get him for free. <laughs> That's funny because it's true. Yeah, yeah, it's true. <laughs> they talk about going to a concert and the highlight was them sitting out in the fucking parking lot and not being able to get in. And they Listening said the from tail, the door. Yeah, they said, what did they say? They said they were tailgating. <laughs> That's yeah. tailgating. Is sitting in tailgating the park a lot bar. of a, yeah, at a bar. <laughs> what the fuck? Genius. Uh, yep. I think exactly. your tags need to say white trash. I can make that happen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Speaking of white trash, number eight, Rebel would like to rescue Leslie from Petey's closet. <laughs> you said speaking of white trash <laughs> well, and I don't know how much more white trash you can get your square's mom working at a whorehouse and you died of syphilis come on 
Oh God, no! I can't believe you're going to say this one on the subway. What am I going to say? This next this has, one. <laughs> this is this good, solid advice. I mean, uh, Rebels bucket list. I don't know why he would do it, but number seven, he wants to teach Wyatt Urkel how to knit items and to sell, like gloves, <laughs> toboggans. Hell, I mean, he'd probably make more money than he will doing DoorDash. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I'm telling you what. Knitters make lots yeah. of money. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> if you ain't shining shoes, then go knit something, for God's sake. That's right. <laughs> Red Reaper likes to whittle. <laughs> Sit on the porch and knit. I know, yeah. <laughs> you did it again. Rebels. You said you did it again. Huh. Huh. Number six, know. Rebels bucket list. Oh. Take Andrea out for a steak and baked potato. <laughs> At least she can chew the baked potato, you know. She ain't gonna be able to chew that steak. You want to yeah. Mo wants to see some of the DMs. Oh, you're going to. We're gonna drop yeah, them. You'll see them. Yeah. Don't forget Mo. They go know, back. Mo. Uh, you should remember back to the cottage. Remember when y'all went to the cottage and that guy Yep. What was that guy's name? Was his guy's name Charlie, I think, maybe? That y'all yep, met, you know, and you got Charlie real mad did, at yeah. him. Yeah. Y'all got mad at him and you started calling me, and Rebel got mad. Then Rebel passed out, and you called me. Yeah. Well, yeah. We, I still got the voicemail saved, so, you know, yeah. there's yeah. that, too. Yeah. Yeah. You, you also, uh, in that last video, you asked for the receipts on Rebel using your phone to sub. We we posted mm -hmm. those receipts. You know, you yeah. actually said it. Yeah. Like, we wouldn't say it if we didn't have, couldn't back it up, Mama. Yeah. Just so you know. Just so yeah. you know. <laughs> yeah, you're 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 living with the guy that has the lies and narratives. So. Mm -hmm. But he did have a bucket yeah. list as well. Yeah. One of the things on his bucket list was number five. He wants to get his robe as white as Jean's couch. <laughs> That's pretty fucking white. It is white. It's very white. Gay men keep a very clean house. And uh, bisexual men like Gene is just ultra clean. I mean, yeah, steam and press and bleach. And I mean, it's just he humps him counters like because he knows they're clean. Oh, the rebel's robe, it, it could be, it could get as clean, you know. It's got a few Maybe. beer stains, got a few pepperoncini Maybe. stains, but it'll be all right. <laughs> Chase with Artemis Pyle. <laughs> Explain why that is why that is uh, quite a thing to do. Yeah, Artemis has had uh, quite a few charges from the 70s and 80s and then again the 90s and the 2000s. Uh, all charges of, uh, you know, being with them uh, old underage girls, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. I sure hope he don't take him up on it, but maybe. Oh, no, maybe. you gotta, you gotta, gotta go back and take the car key out of your ear and listen to the words that come out of your mouth. Like we take yeah. the words that come out of your mouth and then we uh, mm -hmm. make you eat them. So go back there, get out a pen and paper. Yep. Write it down. Think it you over. You did it, Mo. Yeah, you, you said it. Yeah. So uh, I don't know what else to tell we'll you. See. Yeah. No. Oh, there's going to be a domestic, domestic incoming. Yeah, there'll domestic. be another domestic, but we won't care because we won't be there because Rebel will yeah. be dead. Yeah. I mean, he could, he could literally peel your daddy's face off and eat it on stream, and nobody, nobody will be there to watch it. So no, just like you and your kid, you know, nobody cares. <laughs> Let's see. Explain uh, that in a, in a in a comment there, Mo. Uh, the question is, how can you let a drunk son of a bitch pull a gun on your uh, child who's underage and still be with him? Yeah, yeah. I'll wait. There's the question. I'll wait. I'll wait. Bucket list number three from Mo, mm -hmm. or from no, this is from Rebel. It was close. Wants to pile drive Mo's daddy through a coffee table. <laughs> pull a goddamn macho man savage. Off the top turnbuckle, off the damn recliner. <laughs> Rebel, yeah! <laughs> oh, hurt my goddamn. Broke my goddamn lazy bone. 
<laughs> what do you think about that pile driver, Tater? It's top notch, man. <laughs> You said I broke my lazy bone. <laughs> Stand up! Stand up! Stand up, you 75 year old piece of shit! You stand up my ground like a southern outlaw country member! Breathe! Breathe, motherfucker! They can't breathe all of a sudden? <laughs> No, I think he's dead. Oh, God. Look at this. Look at this. Look at her. She responded to you. She answered right. your question. What's it it is. Uh, let me see. Where did it go? It said, I don't see it. Yeah. Yeah, because my son was the first to pull the gun and he was underage then. It oh, doesn't. It sense, I too. don't care. Listen, I don't care if your son pulled a fucking cannon on him. I still wouldn't be with a man who pulled a gun back on my son. <laughs> yeah. Fucking See, wet brain. You should, uh, you should probably teach your son, you know, that it's not a thing to do. And then you should uh, wonder why the fuck an adult would, uh, you know, do a standoff with a, uh, how old was he, like 14? <laughs> You're right. But, and you know, let me let me tell you, the kid already was uh, in bad shape, you know, when he's, uh, you you're out there partying in the garage off with yeah. rebel doing something, letting that kid run amok. The kids at somebody's house and sees, uh, sees another guy blow his brains out playing Russian roulette. Right. It's just a matter of time before somebody gets something bad happen to them in that fucking house. I'm telling you. And that was and, the only and, reason we watched. What? And let me, here's the thing I don't understand is why would you be with a man that would infuriate your underage son so much that he pulled a gun on him? That's what yeah. I don't get. Oh, yeah. God. And here in the next video, we'll play the, the fight again where you're yelling, he didn't do nothing to you. And my daddy, did. he didn't deserve that. He didn't put one hand on you. You shoved him against the door. He didn't deserve that. Leave the house. And he never left the yeah. house and you had him right back, you know ridiculously yeah. two Jeez. videos yeah we have two videos of you screaming at him leave my daddy's house leave my yeah. daddy's house and he does and he continues to be live on youtube so yeah. that just explains that puts your all's relationship in a nutshell um and yeah. she parent hard had a good question why does an underage kid have a gun i mean why <laughs> did your 14 year old kid have access to a gun to pull on your retarded boyfriend i don't get it it's whatever <laughs> Get back to my goddamn bucket list now. Too many, too many questions being pointed out. Now, don't you worry about. It. I'm going to meet that boy at sundown. Me and him near the pool. Uh, first person to draw, you know. I'll draw him. Pull it out! Pull it out! <laughs> I'm still stuck on. I broke my lazy bone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Rebels bucket list uh, number two. He wants to find a picture of me or filthy animal to put on Mo's headboard. <laughs> Boy, that three is just sure is hard tonight. <laughs> I almost felt something. Yeah! I'm done. I finished. I just finished. God damn. They're talking about my little pecker. <laughs> uh, damn talking about my little pecker. I knew that was a bad idea as soon as I did it. I thought, you know, I'm a, I, I probably should have left on my rebel underwear. <laughs> oh. I don't know what else he could have on his bucket list. Let's see here. Number one. That ain't right. Get Jim Crow to sign his vest. That's that's wait racist. A oh, wait a minute. Jim... He's, there's, there was a picture that went along with that. This guy. There he is. Oh, there he is. Jim Crow. There he is. Yeah. <laughs> He's the funniest goddamn crow I've ever seen. <laughs> Smokes his little cigars. You know, he shines shoes himself. <laughs> I, heard I don't he was think doing with some knitting needles. Too. I don't know if he had birds don't need to knit, but he does have on some nice shoes or something. I can't, I can't tell. That's a nice vest you got on there, Mister Crow. <laughs> it's an old blackbird. <laughs> 
And sometimes there's a whole goddamn there's a whole goddamn gang of them crows. You know what they call that? They call them a fucking murder, and they call it for a reason. <laughs> Oh my god, my head hurts. That was uh, Moses. Don't cry, Rick. Don't, don't, don't cry. Rebels bucket list. I feel I feel it coming on. Uh, just saying Moses is good at editing. Yeah. And Rebel ain't good yeah. at nothing. How about that? Moses is <laughs> yeah. I mean, uh I don't It know must be his AI, her her voice, you know, that me and Caparo and, right. and Paula and, and Brandy, all these people got these clips of him, uh, you know, them fighting. And we all got together and was like, you know what? Let's yep. edit Mo in here, making it sound like that Rebel's a fucking idiot beating up this old man, you know? Yeah. That'll get him. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> oh, it's. Um, I think uh, they just admitted, they admitted to this shit. They admitted to it. It's all fake. Just like with Iceman. It's all fabricated. I'm on my spy shit. <laughs> you know, Mo, if you like him young, little spokesman, he's right up there with Rebel. Yeah, he's, he's, sure he's, he's, a, he's available. They've got he probably gets the a, same, uh, he gets a bigger uh, check, uh, brain too, I bet. Age there. Yo, I bet yeah. he does. I bet he does. He's got that special strength. He's a strong little boy, let me tell you. <laughs> strong like an incredible <laughs> hulk. Like an incredible <laughs> hulk. What kind of car do you drive, Bo? I can pick it up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got one more Rebel video before we drop the link, and we're going to say okay. a few words and put this son of a All bitch right. in the ground and uh -huh. bury him where Mo should have the day that he pulled a gun on her kid. That's right. This has been the decline of the wet brain. This is the final. This is when we knew it's. It was. It was a wrap. He, he was. It's gone. over. Yeah. yeah. Like the there Gene team. It's Jump over. Jump out. That's what I want you to do. Jump out. Yeah. Where the black boys at? Where the black boys at? I got. I got a lot of black folks, man. Where the black. Where the black folks at? Where the black boys at? My pity work for most of the seats. I believe you're gonna get killed for that shit. Moses hates. I'm going to go out to the car to get my vest. I'm going to get him signed back over. Down in Dick's head. What's up, man? You remember me? Oh, yeah. What up, man? You talk about where the black man I'm going to go get my vest, man. You talk about where the black boys at. Well, hell, I'm going to get one and sign the vest. The seat was. The seat was. Am I ready Yeah, you should see where the black boys at. I ain't where the black boys at. I ain't where the black boys at. I ain't where the black boys at. Booty, booty, Judy. Booty, Judy. I ain't where the black boys at. Booty, Judy. Booty, Judy. I ain't where the black boys at. Booty, Judy. Booty, Judy. I ain't where the black boys at. We're donating. Guns that kill Moses. Cause we're, we're, we're donating guns that kill Moses. Yeah, come here and kiss me. What a lie to you. Oh, you want to fuck me, ready? Right? I'm proud of you. Yeah, you want to get high and fuck? I like to lay you on my bed and spread eggs. Because we we'll both kill you ass. We don't give a fuck. I never said I killed him. Well, he said you ain't scared. I ain't scared. Them. Like, like them, the black boy said, uh, hey, it's a good day. I didn't have to use my AK. They're coming for you. You can believe what you want. I don't give a fuck. But you don't know how to fucking run a household and fucking pay your bills, pay your bills, pay your bills, and fucking get your shit done. But I fucking do. Who? Me. Fucking take care of my shit. I'm not doing anything. I will defend myself, and I'm not doing anything. I'm not doing anything. I didn't fuck up anything. I'm not trying to hurt you.
Like I said, people trying to provoke you, you stay in your ground. Good morning. Good morning, Flame for Jesus. How you doing, brother? Hey, man, God bless you. Thank you. God bless you. I'm over here working 50 hours with the Mexicans and the Africans. I mean, because the other one's a wigger. He's completely like Cashfield. He's done so to so to the whole black community. The devil himself. And, or something was like took over him and made him go to the black side. So white dude that want to be so black, so bad, they go to the black side. Meanwhile, they still ain't talked about my dead mother. But when they do, they can get their goddamn dead. They can get fucking dead, and we can talk about them being dead. We gonna find you. I ain't playing. Start it and see. Start it and see. He don't like that big fat whore bird. He don't like that big fat whore bird. I told you y'all petty. Y'all y'all damn give a fuck. But see, we give a fuck about you hanging out with the black boys. Well, no, like, that's enough for us to right there and say like, what the fuck, man? That shit don't look good, man. So how you gonna loop the loop when you can't even damn? Tie a fucking fish on your hook, you know? Best believe we'll be calling Wally's a million times every day. Calling Wally's. Just to, just to damn, uh, just call Wally's. We'll be sure to call Wally's. Be prepared Monday morning. Just giving you a heads up. Come Monday morning, be for sure to fucking damn get a heads up with call the Wally's. Oh, yes, Bird loves that black cock so much. It's God Almighty. It's God Almighty. And it's all about my dick. Then I jump on the panel with Square, and I ain't even put my dick in it. How damn I'd rather you shave your pews before I get down on my knees sucking on it. And I'm like, what the fuck is down with a little jean, with a trainee? Yiggity yak, don't talk back. It's God Almighty. I put mayonnaise and mustard in my damn potato salad. Ruski got the hoodie on the panel with the return to the rebel. With the retarded rebel. Yeah, that's. <laughs> it looks like Rebel's ghost has taken over Moses. He'll be right back, folks. But can you all believe that? So, Mo, explain that. You said in your little uh, comment up here, yeah, I lived it. Yeah, but the thing is, you lived it and you went back. That's what's crazy is that you lived it and then you 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 kept living it. You, you went back. I, I don't understand. I don't understand how any woman who loved her children or lived with their daddy and uh, loved their daddy would allow for that kind of shit to happen. I, I, I just don't get it. I don't get it. But uh, yeah, let's read some of these. Let's see. I would be embarrassed as fuck if this was my life. Exactly, Laura. I don't understand why, how you can't be embarrassed. And the thing is, is it's not only have they done all of this stuff, you know, he's uh, rebels been on here acting like this and, and doing all this stuff and everything. And she's been right there by his side, egging it on or being a part of it. Uh, not only has that happened, but uh, they keep doing it. I mean, they just continue to do it, which is why, and it's, but anymore, it's just, it's not even entertaining. There's a, po there's a point when it just becomes so repetitive it's so just, it's hard to watch it. And I think that's where we're at now. Well, as a matter of fact, I know that's where we're at now. Um, it has become a chore to watch. So we're just going to go ahead and put them in the casket and uh, we're going to steal it up real good. And uh, yeah, we're going <laughs> to, it's, it's over. It, it's, it's over. 
rebel team lost. It's over. In the good words of a filthy animal. Uh, we're gonna. I'm gonna drop the link here in a minute. Let me. Uh, yeah, on the internet, T. Dam. That's the thing. Is it's like it's bad enough that it's happening and that people know it's happening, but they continue to put it like they blast it on YouTube publicly for everybody to see it, and uh, they just have, they have no shame. Y'all didn't live it. Y'all don't really know any of us. Rip us to rest, please. Oh, we're going to. We're going to. Your boyfriend's not going to like it very much. Put us to rest, please. Your boyfriend's not going to like it very much because he's no. going to notice that absolutely that number there at the top where it tells how many people are watching, there's going to be nobody there anymore. And he tends to get a little bit belligerent. And I, I can't imagine. I see how he acts on YouTube, like publicly when it happens. I can't imagine what he does to you when it's done. I wish y'all would go away, though. You all had every opportunity, Mo, to go away on your own. And y'all could have just, I mean, we gave y'all, we personally said bunches of times, like, okay, well, we'll quit messing with you. But y'all just kept on. Uh, Yeah, there we go. Why don't we go ahead and drop the link since uh, Mo has a lot to say. Maybe she might want to come up. Yeah, it's a link. Yeah. Lots of times I didn't even know he was live. Think about all the shit y'all ain't seen. But, you, but you're still there. But you're still there. That's what's so weird is like you play this victim role in chats, but you're still there. I don't get it. Hit the link, Mo. Come up here and tell us about it. I'll, I'll mute my mic since you like talking to Moses more than you like talking to me anyway. So, But come on up, uh, Mo. There's that link. I'm going to pin it for you. Hold on. Oh, yeah. My internet's been going in and out here. It's crazy. So uh, I may drop out again. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Huh. Uh, that's weird. It's usually me. Yeah, I know. <laughs> you said, yeah, I know. All right. Let me pin this link here. She's not going to hit it. She's just like, uh, she's just like the not. rest of them. Yeah. Uh, yeah, she won't, she won't hit it, but, uh, somebody else will. Hello, sir. Hello, good people. How are you? Great, What's great. I, I just, hello, Moses. What up, squirrel? I just had a small poem for the dearly departed, and then I will be on my way. Oh, okay, yeah, this will be wonderful. good. All right, here we go. The mountains are blue. The General Lee is pink. Throw this motherfucker in the dirt. He's beginning to stink. Good riddance, you racist motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Get him the fuck out of here. That's yeah, right. For real. He's out of here. He's Can you imagine what it smells like in that old musty ass house by the time him and Mo get done and upstairs and Mo's daddy's good God almighty. <laughs> She probably smells worse than turkeys. She already oh, said her pee uh, stinks, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so, ugh. gross. That was a wonderful poem, Mustard. Thank you so much for sharing it with us. Yeah, I'm you touched. bet. Right. Thank y'all. Thank y'all. <laughs> Good you. evening. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I'm I'm touched, but not the way uh, not the way spokesman gets touched. You know what I mean. <laughs> oh, so one time, one time I was touched. I, I do the touching. I do the touching. See, I'm not a link hitter. I love them all. I'm not a. Where's it at? Where did it go? She don't even know what a fuck a link is. No, she don't. I bet she would. She would uh, lose her way. I'm not a link hitter. Yeah. I love them all. Listen. I, you can love somebody, but when it, it one time, one time's too much, but, uh, it, it's, it's constant. I mean, we've seen it. We've seen y'all do it a hundred times and you just keep doing it. I don't know. Whatever. Yeah. I don't know. I was worse than Sasquatch. <laughs> and that's a must have squawped and threatened to kill my friend, Chris. <laughs> I threatened to kill Squire, little Square, Uncle Squarehead. Uncle Rebel. Uncle Rebel. 
<laughs> Somebody said, wash your puss, Mo. Yeah, wash your puss. Yeah, come on. Your piss wasn't stinking so bad. You wash it, you know. That's probably why Rebel <laughs> stalls. And, yeah. Well, he said it there. He said, uh, you know, about shaving and when he's before yeah. he goes down. and uh, Oh, yeah. that's right, Church of Bankatology. She'll hit Rebel, but not the link. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> <laughs> She found her heart said the link isn't the only thing rebel isn't hitting. Ain't <laughs> that the truth? <laughs> yeah. uh, if Did anybody you, else. There's what? a picture. I don't know if you got the picture. Uh, somebody kicked it over on the back street to old hag. Let me see if uh, I can find let me it. Get it real quick. Uh, uh, I'm going to find it. Hold on. Yeah, but it's. It's, it's come to an end. I mean, he was uh, he was all right for a little while, but I figure in just a couple months, he's just going to be muttering to himself, staggering all over the place like he was in that clip, you know, when he was at the gas station. I mean, he was drunk yeah. as hell. Oh, God. Uh, oh, yeah. The, the, the gas pump's kind of like government property, ain't it? <laughs> yeah, I want to put a sticker on it. Yeah. <laughs> That was talking in the middle of the day, and he was walking around drunk. Are you talking about the uh, one under where there's two pictures? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah, I think so. Okay. All right. It's a, it's a picture from tonight of Rebel. I think they got a picture of him. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. Hold on. Uh, let me see. That's the wrong thing. I had the wrong thing. Oh, hold on a second. Yeah, I see it now. Hold on one second. Yeah. You know, and the glasses, uh, uh, when he started wearing the glasses all the time and taking them on vacation with him, uh, you got a little weird there. Yeah. You know, most people don't even don't even bother getting on YouTube, you know, during their vacation. Not him. You know, he's floating around the lazy river, puts on the glasses, screaming at me. Right. His kids are floating around, you know. He did float around the lazy river with your glasses on. Yeah. And on the beach. Oh, it was so crazy. Yeah, walking around nuts. the beach. Yeah, they went right back here. to the Hold cottage. On. Everywhere he goes, he takes them. This is the picture from the program at the uh, funeral. Oh, there we go. He looks so natural. <laughs> so natural. <laughs> Got his little iron heart plates laid out there. <laughs> oh, he's got the glasses. Rip Rebel. Rip Rebel. Thank you, buddy, for yeah. that one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It, it's about it's about time for it to be over for him though. And he really is like me. uh wait a minute. I clicked on the wrong one. So. <laughs> Put a picture of Mo's dad on the link, maybe Rebel will hit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Rebel is obsessed with Moses. I have to get a PPO on him. Uh, he's a little more than uh, obsessed with him. You heard Taps playing? Well, I think we're going to do a three Rebel salute to get him out of here. Wait a minute. Yeah. I just helped him gorilla glue the fuzzy eyebrows back on the glasses. Well. Yeah. That's not really her. That's got to be a troll account in here under her name. Hold on a second. Check her out. Uh, yeah, I'm going to, because she wouldn't say that. She wouldn't say, nope, It's she said that. <laughs> she said That's that. That's really her, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Wow. Wow. <laughs> the things you do I mean, for love. The things you do for love. You know, you know I, I remember. Know I, go ahead. I remember, I remember when I was like, 13 14 years old and me and my friends used to like steal liquor from our parents and we would go and we would drink and you know get drunk really easily and stuff and we would do like little childish stupid shit like glue fuzz uh, gorilla glue fuzzy eyebrows on glasses but i would never imagine that someone in their 40s their late 40s at that i would never imagine that would be something that they would consider a good time but that's just me, you know. Yeah. Yeah. The other thing is, I got a picture of Mo's ex wearing those glasses too. Like, yep. He also wore heaps of glasses. Strange. Yep. Isn't that where uh, Rebel got them from? 
Probably. So. He never will admit it, but yeah, he says he bought them with his hard-earned money. So yeah, he probably stole them from Chris Rose. <laughs> probably. You know, so. I just I don't think people are understanding exactly the magnitude yeah. of this death. I mean, the death. I wish we had like a song that would put it into put it into well, perspective. It's funny just, you mention. Yeah, it's funny you mention that because uh, we do have a song. We do have a another song, one. and yeah, another one. This will, this will and, be the third uh, Rebel production. Yeah, uh, you know I think what? Three that, for Dale. Three for Dale. <laughs> three for Rebel yells. All right. Well, um, you want to play it now? Let me hear your Rebel yell. <laughs> Let me hear your Rebel yell. Let me hear your Rebel yell. Chada. <laughs> <laughs> Hollywood. All right, here we go. The taps of this funeral. I was watching Rebel Street. He was acting pretty mean He began to lose control He began to lose control I didn't mean to hurt you I'm sorry that I made you move I didn't want to hurt you It's only you two You were feeling insecure Mo might not want you anymore that time yeah. I didn't want to hurt you I'm just that kind of guy of that old guy I did not want to hurt you I'm just that kind of guy He told you to leave his home But you stayed and drank alone It's only you 
to watch out now. That's right. It's on YouTube. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That oh, touched yeah. me right there. It brought a tear to my eye. Yeah, me too. It brought it a tear to my eye. It brought a tear to my eye. I mean, that's but, sad. Let me tell you what's. Let me tell you what's even sadder. What's that? Read, read that, read that. Now we just watched the video where she says, mm -hmm. "He just walked towards you. He didn't lay a finger on you, and you shoved him against that door for no reason. Get out! Get out!" Yep. And then she and says, so then, "Then she says some dumbass shit like that." Rebel didn't hit my dad. My dad hit him or tried. He pushed my dad, and my dad came at him with his cane. But it was audio, not video. Then she also, she followed that up with, y'all didn't have to grow up with my dad either. I guess I'm very accepting. My dad asked in two days if Rebel was over his mad spell. That's funny, because he came back that same night. Does it really matter? I mean, if Rebel would have pulled out a gun and shot your dad... Would it have mattered? No, you would have tried to keep Rebel out of jail. Uh, I know you would. Yep. This, you just, yep. You know. And the reason that we know that you would is because we actually, um, uh, Moses and I talk behind the, uh, and that's who you, that's the thing, Mo, that infuriates me so much about it is that you feel sorry for him because, yeah, he walked home 13 miles that night. So yeah. you, it's like you feel pity, like poor, poor rebel had to walk 13 miles home that night yeah, instead he, of, instead of didn't. my poor dad got assaulted in his own home. That's yeah. who you should be. Yeah. You know, whatever. Yeah. And the yeah. fool didn't walk no damn 13 miles. You know, he got a, he was thumbing a ride. Hell, he told us mm -hmm. that uh, before he got to the end of the driveway, you was calling and begging him to come home. Yeah. I mean. Y'all are yep. just ridiculous. And, yeah. Yep, it, it does. Dead. You're right. Mo does sound like Bo trying to make excuses. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. She would have been there to bail him out first thing, you know. Hey, Dad, mind I hit you, Daddy. Can we come yeah. back and get drunk in your house because we ain't got nowhere else to go even though I'm fucking 50? Get the fuck. Yep. 50 years old and you can't even get drunk in your own house because you're afraid this dude might pull a gun on your kids and you're in here making excuses for him for for assaulting your dad in his yeah. home in your dad's home yeah and, on, on and you're in you're defending it to us i mean that's what's so bad about it that's yeah. what we call in the um in the locale business mooing that's what that would be what what, what you're doing but yeah just keep on Mo White, Mo White. <laughs> That's right. No, actually, yeah. it's yeah. Mo Cook. Mo Cook. <laughs> Mo and Bo, couple mm. of enabling losers. That's right. That's right. But at least, uh, at least you lose yours. You know, Durkey, he'll be back raising hell. Uh, we don't know what Rebel will do because he's he's gone. He's gone. Yeah. His brain's been gone. And uh, Mustard Squirrel come up and says some words. We're putting mm -hmm. him in the grave. If anybody yep. else wants to come up, now's the time. Yep. Speak now, because, forever. Uh, hold your peace. Yep. Yeah. Because and uh, if you don't, if you can't hold your piss, be sure to put the seat up when you go into the bathroom because we know <laughs> Mo don't like that. And also make sure it doesn't stink. Uh, yeah. If uh, after this, we're not saying we won't. He won't pop up in a, a top 10. A Colonel Rebel might make a appearance. Oh, yeah. But, but uh, yeah, unless uh, short of uh, causing another insurrection, we're probably not going to cover um, uh, Rebel anymore because he's dead. Yeah. Y'all surely have to get along with people that don't get along with each other. No, I, no. I, I, I don't, I don't, uh, I, I don't like welcome toxicity into my life like that. If I'm around yeah. two people who don't get along with each other, I'm not around those two people anymore. I'll go, yeah. if I need to be around them, I'll go around them separately. And I certainly won't put it on YouTube, but you know, that's just me. And like your, your kids and your dad, like I can understand if like, Oh, we don't come around my coworkers, you know, because I try to keep a level of professional, you know, 
try to keep you know up and up with my coworkers. But your your dad and your son can't be around the person that you're, I guess, spending your life with. You're waiting on that million dollars, you know. Mm-hmm. You both said that too in that clip. I'm glad I found that because you both denied that too. Yeah. Oh, well, just talking about a million dollars. You sit there and you're bragging to your dad about a million dollars that you're going to get once uh, once the rich daddy dies, you know. Ridiculous. Yep. Like, you yeah. act like the people don't. It is uh, ridiculous don't watch or like you, you think you're getting stuff over on people. I don't know what you're thinking. <laughs> Jesus, <laughs> Christ. Jesus Christ. Y'all can't tell me your pee doesn't smell different when you drink coffee or eat asparagus. I drink water. So no, mine usually doesn't. Uh, I don't. I don't well, know, and uh, if it, if it does smell different. Yeah. If it does smell different, it certainly doesn't smell different enough for me to notice. Yeah. And uh, yeah. <laughs> so well, that's, Mo, there's, well there's the thing. Rebel did say she pissed in the bed. So I guess you're going to got to change the sheets. You get a whiff of it. <laughs> Which from the past it smells like a cat sprayed in here. <laughs> do, you do get a whiff of it when you have to change the sheets. Uh, yeah. Uncle Gwen gets a whiff and I take a, a shit mer in the floor. And it stinks. And then I take a piss on the couch. But the goats piss too. So it stinks. <laughs> Oh, Fufu said, none of us will ever know. It stinks, it stinks worse anything. than on my birthday. Arm flap slap for Boss Lady <laughs> Bird. And it made my whole face stink. My whole face it stinks. <laughs> that was one of my favorite parts of the birthday celebration. Uh, none of us will ever know if Rebel does anything retarded because we won't watch to see it. We will, however, assume wherever he is, he is being retarded. Absolutely. Yeah. Rick and, yeah, and you know, Rick this is just what we see. This is just what we see yeah. on uh, on YouTube. Imagine what we yeah. don't see. My God. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. I don't want to imagine it because if I imagine it, it makes me want to call the um, the police for domestic assault even more. Uh, <laughs> like Mustard Squirrel said, Rick and Morris has set in. Rick and Morris. <laughs> Rick and Morris. <laughs> <laughs> Rick and Morris. Uh, if you drink enough beer, you won't have kidney stones. I'm done. I can't talk to her anymore. I can't. I, I, just, I just can't. If you drink enough anymore. beer, you won't have a brain stone either. <laughs> and, your, and your lazy bone might get broken. <laughs> <laughs> She's never making excuses for being an alcoholic, making excuses for beating up old men, making excuses for pulling a gun on kids. <laughs> Making excuses for her pee stinking. It's so fucking weird. You sure you don't want to hit that link and get up here and just moo? Because I couldn't imagine the shit that would come out of your mouth. you got to be drunk right now. got to be. Ain't no way you're going to work to tomorrow being this retarded. There's no way. There's no way. I thought that the spokes tarted celebration was retarded. This is getting there. This is topping it. The shit that happens at these funerals. My God. If you drink enough beer, Chief Counter said, no kidney stones or children. <laughs> <laughs> well, have no job either. Don't worry about them either. <laughs> That's right, T. Darren. And she works around the elderly. That's what we need to be scared of is she works yeah. around the elderly. Jesus. But they're all incapacitated elderly from what I understand. So Yeah, they're in their high uh, 90s. Uh, she said, y'all the ones... Keeping me up later than usual. Heck yeah, I'll work tomorrow. Good Lord almighty. Well, yeah, you probably just give the old old fucker some Benadryl and y'all both just sit there and nap and drool on each other. <laughs> oh, my God. That's right. Well, you know what else has, no one else has any words to say over this, uh, this um, <laughs> dumpster fire getting put to rest? You know I what? The Gene team would have something to say. You know what they'd say? What? Chill, chill. <laughs> chill. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> mm. <laughs> what up? What up? <laughs> chill. Yeah. Fuck them all. Mm, yeah. Chit chat, chat, chat. Come on. Uh. 
just making noises and time for musical interlude. Interlude. Hold on. <laughs> that is it. Oh my god. <laughs> Do that. Next time next time y'all are listening to a snipe of the gene team, see how long it goes before they actually say English sometimes. Sometimes it gets up to like a minute, minute and a half. You know, so, my guy, my guy, chick chick, my guy, yeah. <laughs> so fucking cringy. Mm. <laughs> oh, fuck them all, go squid head. Fuck them all. <laughs> Sexual shit. Oh, say it, say it. Where were they at? This has been worse than being on. This is worse than watching Sasquatch. They've been making fun of Uncle Uncle Rebelhead. They've been making fun of Uncle Rebelhead and Aunt Mo Idiot all night. And now they're doing sexual shit. <laughs> it's, not, it's, it's not right. And plus, uh, Uncle, they know that Uncle Emery's going to kill somebody. It's not good. <laughs> I heard that I'm a pickpocket. PJ the pickpocket is what they call me. So I'm uh, I'm probably assuming that I think Hellbilly and uh, Spokes Tart have taken over Rebel and uh, uh, Moe's spot on our little roster here. So, oh, that's enough. Yeah. Yeah. Where's my liquor? Where's my liquor? Chia, chia. The chia is what gets me more than anything. Yeah, chia. <laughs> yeah I mean, just like, uh, just like, you know, in that video when... Uh... Those names, those losers that used to support us went across the screen. Yeah. One falls out, two comes back, you know. That's right. Just making that's making right. room for some better content, making room for better people. Yeah. yeah, that's right. That's right. Well, I guess uh we'll lay this to rest. Moses, do you have any final words that you'd like to to say? Oh yeah, Rebel will be with Puff. Rip Puff. Yeah. Rip Puff, poor Puff. I want to thank Mustard Squirrel for the beautiful poem. Yeah. I want to thank Mo for the uh, chat mooing. Uh, <laughs> Pure I want to mooing thank... is good milk I mean, there, Mo. Good yeah, mood. and believe me, <laughs> Hag and I have screenshot every comment you made. So, uh, yeah. Classic. What's the bop sound? Bop! I don't know what the bop sound is. <laughs> Uh, it's oh, oh King Boo Boo. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I, I I can't get into him. He's the one, Moses. Before we go, he's mm -hmm. the one that was uh, that clip that um, somebody sent us. He's the one that was saying that we're always in the comments of his videos talking oh, yeah. shit to him. Yeah, I don't I know never... what what planet they fucking live on over there. I really don't. Like no. he he said that we go into his comments that we follow him. And then dumbass Hellbelly said that uh, we've got filthy animal is our intro now. Our intro is all filthy animal. Uh, we need to have changed our intro. intro <laughs> <we're forever>. here. <laughs> yeah. and the only change we made to our intro was we added uh, King Cobra to it. But besides yeah. that, we've had the same intro since we started this. Maybe so, he thinks filthy's Cobra. I don't know. I mean, he might. Maybe he does. <laughs> Who knows? It really didn't make any yeah. sense. Anything they were saying. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. I've never watched him. I, I don't know what he, uh, what he does, but, uh, I know he's got, uh, I'm not, is that King Kush? I know he's got the big, the big titties. Uh, yeah. He's, he's, he he's, it, he's competing with bird with titties. Yeah. He wears a mask. Yeah. 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 And he sounds like a fucking idiot. That's, that's about all I know. And yeah. for some reason, he thinks yeah. that we follow him. <laughs> and, uh, you know, Hillbelly was saying that uh, he thought it was crazy that we was trying to get him or spokesman to hit the link. He said yeah. that, uh, you know, we, we never hit the gene link. And you don't understand, like, how that blocking works. But Yeah. You know, yeah we're and blocked. Like, he's not. He's scared is what it is. That's why he didn't hit yeah. Little Me's link. That's why Mo didn't hit this link. They're scared to get verbally abused. Although Mo's not afraid to get physically abused. Right, <laughs> domestically abused. Oh, it's crazy. It's crazy. All right, well, let's put this fool in the ground, Mose. Uh, he's out. I mean, he's like a crushed up bush like can. I say, <laughs> slam the coffin, never look back. Anybody that's in his chat, mm -hmm. if I look over there and see in the chat, you're gonna, I'm gonna let it be known too. Same way with Iceman, 
anybody who's simping mm-hmm. nice, man, you're just getting ready to step in a bunch of shit that he could eat, you know? <laughs> you don't want to do that. You don't want to mess with the ice, man. No, no, no. Because I mean, shit, we still end up smelling like it. Hold on a minute. Let me see if I loaded it up. I'm not sure if I did or not. All right. Uh, hold on one second. Yeah, I did. Huh. If anybody needs to know, this was actually uh, this was a real text message. Is yeah. it showing? Why isn't it showing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. Okay. All right. Um, this was an actual text message that was sent to me by uh, Rat Thaniel saying, uh, what does this say? I can't see it. It was not showing. On your right. cell phone at 2.27 a.m. Mm-hmm. It says, I guess would be means you're going to have a difficult time eating with your jaw wires shut. Have difficulty seeing with your eyelids sewn shut. Mm-hmm. So that's what he, he's all about <laughs> there. And that was all because Moses and I wouldn't go after Triple T. That's why yeah. we got I got that text message because yeah. we said, no, we wouldn't um, help him go after Triple T because we didn't have a problem with Triple T. Triple T's always been cool with us, good people to us. So anyway, that's what, what that's what we're dealing with there with Rhett Daniel. Yeah. And just remember, you could be the next person that that. Uh, 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 you can be the next person. All right. Well, uh, where's those DMs? Mo, <laughs> unlike uh, Rebel, we have other shit to do than to be on YouTube. I'll be dropping them. Yeah. You just uh, I'll make sure that I tag you and uh, Rebel's account that he had before he passed. Yeah, Believe that it. just came up. You know, somebody in the chat had a question after after we proved one receipt. You know. Somebody's like, well, let's see the others. You know, I was like, well, okay, we got them. But I'm not going to go in and start chopping and cropping and uploading for you right now because uh, yeah. you're the locale, you know. Yeah, exactly. You Nathaniel wait. Whitless is right. That's right, Nathaniel Whitless. Uh, you appreciate the Mo Honey Queen Bee avatar, too. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Uh, whatever. All right, bank- Church Bankatology, we will. We will. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, I guess we'll take it out then on the new Rebel song. Uh, let's take uh, it out on the uh, on the Canapolis song. I like that one a lot better. We'll take it out on that one. Okay. All right. We'll do that. Um, y'all go check out Donald's live. Um, I don't know who else is live. I, I, whatever. You know, it's it is what it is. But uh, go check out Donald. Uh, yeah. love to all I ain't mad at you nobody cares um, we will see you all on the members live Sunday night and we will probably be back here next Wednesday we'll see we'll see what happens we'll see what's going oh, on oh that's everybody. good yeah Square's got some heavy content uh, going on right now what's he doing? sounds a lot like <laughs> <laughs> of course <laughs> of course uh, all right, y'all. We well, all have a great night. Thank you all uh, for coming to our solemn ceremony. Moses, take us out of here. All right, I'm gonna take T Dam out too. T Dam, that's why you got blocked last time. We don't want to hear some boring shit up in here. <laughs> Be good to everybody. Take care of yourself and each other. Have your pets spayed or neutered. And one last time, Rebel Yell! Jada. <laughs> good night, y'all. <laughs> I'm not real smart and I got a wet brain. Too much but I can drive a man insane. Most at his will, my ticket's filled. Turn a rebel race, just cook all the money. Live with my dad cause I ain't got no money. Get what I want from a mo queen bee, honey. Can't change her mind, my crops are fine. Turn a rebel race, just cook all the money. Kiss me tater. Mmm, feel good. Oh, Matata, I want to love you like a southern rebel shoe. I lie, sometimes they'll turn this wheel too far to the right, 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 right. I like the thing that Mo does with the thumbs. It kind of hurts, but it sure is fun. My brain is crazy, in love with Daisy. Colonel Rebel Brace is cook all the muddy. Yiggity yak, don't talk back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I put mayonnaise and mustard in my hands and said, Yeah, yeah. Kiss 
potato? Ooh, I feel good. Home potato. Well, I want to love you like a southern rebel should. Dale died. That time, he turned his wheel too far to the right, 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 right. And I like a thing that Mo does with the thumbs. It kind of hurts, but it sure is fun. My brain is crazy, in love with Daisy. Colonel Rebel Race just cook all the money.